fingers crossed that it stays stays legit hi cora happy friday ah okay so it's currently 12 17 but what i'm gonna do because i'm a sucker for this shit is i'm gonna wait for it to turn to 12 18 because uh i'm a little bit frustrated because i opened this game to be like hey let me set things up there we go but it's having me put in the time again I remembered your name because I tried my best. I tried so hard, Cora. Aw, okay. I'm a little bit frustrated, but it's being sweet. Okay, I'll I'll leave that be. Aw. Of course, even if it doesn't do anything, it's like, but what if it did do something? I love timed events. I'm a sucker for that shit. They are, I promise. <gasps> oh, that's sweet. Ah, oh, I remember that. The next time I play this game, it sounds like I'm gonna set it to 420. <laughs> Cause I'm a uh, 12. Let's double check the audio. We'll see how loud it is. I'll turn it down if need be. Aw, okay. I'll let Cory know in case he comes over. I'll be like, hey, you gave a gift sub to Cora, so haha. -ha. Almost like name twinsies. So, full disclaimer. I've never technically played this game before. Any of the Stanleys. I've watched this is people. The story of a man named Stanley. I've played a tiny bit of the demo. Stanley worked for a company in a big building where he was employee number 427. Employee number 427. Look at me, I'm a basic simple. bitch. He sat at his desk in room 427 and he pushed buttons. <gasps> That's me working for the nuns. I just do buttons at the computer. Desk, telling him what buttons to push how long to push them, and in what order. This is what employee 427 did every day of every month of every year. And although others might have considered it soul lifting, no you swaggy. every okay. moment that the orders came in. Happy Friday, Stanley welcome to the game. Gay two, Stanley two sub, two month Stanley. streak gay. Thank you for the resub, day, swaggy. Something very peculiar happened. Something Welcome to the video game that you were looking forward to. Something he would never Finger guns. Pew, 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 pew. He had been at his desk for nearly an hour when he realized that not one single order had arrived on the monitor for him to follow. No Oof. one had showed up to give him instructions, call a meeting, or even say hi. Never in all his years at the company had this happened. This complete isolation. It's okay, Stanley. It's Something just very clear a surprise wrong. party. Shot, or maybe it's a holiday. Solid, Stanley found himself unable to move for the longest time. But as he came to his wits and regained his senses, ooh, 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 ooh. he got up from his desk and stepped out of his office. So... Apple charged you twice on accident yesterday? Oh, Apple is so cringe. Oh, damn. That's effort. That clock probably actually works. I'm sorry they charged you twice, gamer. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. So, I know the vibe of this game is like, who? I'm not gonna follow... Oh. I'm not gonna follow the orders, but like... Just for a moment, what if, you know? Can I zoom in or anything? Oh. Sorry. Should I turn off all the computers? Would that be responsible of me? Oh, hi, Dabbers! Is someone playing Solitaire? Rude. Happy Friday, welcome to the game!
be happy. Also, ooh, retail training on Wednesday. I hope that goes well. Get that good money. Everything for the planet. I only turned off one computer, though. I'll have to do that the next time I come through. Hello. I want to turn it off. I want to do my part. Yet there was not a single person here either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley White decided board to manager. go up to his boss's office, hoping he might find an answer there. Hmm. I looked at that smudge and I'm like, what's censored there? And I was like, oh no, it's not censored. It's just a waste. Can I turn this off? Hello? What's running this? Sorry? Oh, thank you. Why am I just clicking? Okay. Broom closet ending. Hmm, that sounds familiar, Wolfgang. Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. Is that red? Hello? Why is it so red down there? That's spooky. No, thank you. Damn. How come the boss gets the good shit? What? I just... Hello? Is this computer on? Okay. Being responsible. Hello? Stepping into his manager's office, Stanley was once again stunned to discover not an indication PNG. of any human life. Shocked, unraveled, Stocking Stanley things, wondered registers, in just self checkouts. This. What dark secret so... was being held from him? What he could not have known was that the keypad behind the boss's desk guarded uh -oh. the terrible truth that his boss had been keeping from him. And so the boss had assigned it an extra Sorry, I just want to make sure I pay attention to the number real quick. Two, eight, four, five. Okay, thank but you. of course, Stanley couldn't possibly have known this. So should I just leave then? Uh, the idea of Stanley Parable is it's a little bit of like a fucky-wucky game. Uh, I remember the basic premise of the first game was like, hey, the narrator wants you to do things. And Stanley you're supposed just to sat around twiddling his thumbs, trying to input anything on the device yeah. was useless, since he could never possibly know <laughs> the gamer. that the combination was two eight. So you're like five. supposed to follow what the narrator does, but then it's like, hey, you're not supposed to not follow the directions. Keypad? Two eight four five. Dude, like I get it. Existential comedy is a very good way of uh, of summarizing it, Swaggy. Happened to input the correct code by sheer luck. Amazing. Ooh. He stepped into the newly opened passageway. Hello. It's a little spooky in here, huh? It's a little spooky, a little dark. I would definitely say like big comedy. Big existential. I at least need to follow them once, Wolfgang, you know? At least once. And then we can do some bullshit. Descending deeper into the building, Stanley realized he felt a bit peculiar. It oh. was a stirring of emotion in his chest, as though he felt more free to think for himself, to question the nature of his job. Every time Why did he uh, feel Wolfgang, this no. When for years it had never occurred to him. This question would not go unanswered for long. Oh boy, am I getting a peculiar feeling. Stanley walks straight ahead <laughs> to the large door. Damn, all right. Mind control facility. I mean, tempting, but also like follow the instructions for now. Oh, I love the Incredibles. This is my favorite scene. They're gonna tell me all my friends are dead. The lights rose on an enormous room packed with television screens. What horrible Streamers secret be did like. this place hold? Stanley thought to himself. 
Did he have the strength to find out? Look at all those numbers. Griffs, numbers. I will say though, like, I'm willing to go along with it because clearly the narrator has a story he wants to tell. Hello? Now the monitors jump to life. Their true nature revealed. Each What's with the blue the man up there? An employee in the building. Stanley's co-workers. The lives of so many individuals reduced to images on a screen. And Stanley, one of them, eternally monitored in this place where freedom meant nothing. Where, where, I forgot my number. Was it 234? Because that was a weird lad up there. I want to see... What does that say? I can't read it. This mind control facility, it was too horrible to believe. It couldn't be true. Had Stanley really been under someone's control all this time? No, not was at all. Was this the only reason he was happy with his boring job? That 427? Okay, been give me a second, Wolfgang. I'm sorry. One, two, three, two, three, four, two, seven. That's me! My darkly lit office. 100% be a G-man hidden up there. Hell yeah. I mean, no. pirate? I he saw. He refused to believe it. Pirate? He couldn't accept it. His own life pirate? in someone else's Employee control. Employee pirate? It, can Never. that be me? It was unthinkable. Wasn't it? Was it even possible? Had he truly spent his entire life utterly blind to the world? Oh, hello. But here was the proof. The heart of the operation. Controls but where's labeled with everybody emotions. else then? Happy or sad or content, walking, eating, oh, working. Oh, I love inside all of it out. And commanded from this very place. And as the cold reality of his past began to sink in, Stanley decided that this machinery would never again exert its terrible power over another human life. Okay, so where do you want for me to go? For he would then. dismantle the controls once and for all. I'm gonna be a hero. Uh, that's some portal shit. Ah. Hello. Blue. What's with the buttons? Hello. There are buttons. I don't have a code, so let's just keep doing it. We. I can press them, but I don't know why the buttons are there. I'm not seeing a seven, else I would try the two four seven one thing. Don't starve is a very fun game. I'm bad at it, but it's fun. Eh. It's blacked. I can't go in. Rude. I don't want it to go online. Let's just follow the story for now. No, you're valid, Wolfgang. You just need to have the right sort of vibe to want to play Don't Starve. Wait, hello? Oh, that's just words right there. Oh, is this it? Last, he found the source of the room's power. It's a little bit of a simple he story. Was his duty, his Danger, electric shock To put risk. an end to this horrible place and to everything it stood but for. But it is a fun game. It's a very cute game. There's a lot of stuff that I'm not familiar with in it. And a rising chill of uncertainty. Was it over? We did it! We were the hero! We beat the game! Yes! He had won! He had defeated the machine! 
Unshackled himself from some You have over 800 power. hours in that game? Holy Freedom heck. You sunk away. a lot of time into that game. You and must yet, really like it. Even as the immense door slowly opened, Stanley reflected on how many puzzles still lay unsolved. Where had his co workers gone? How had next been game! From uh, next, we'll be grass. playing Nekopara 4. What did this strange building hold? But as sunlight streamed into the chamber, he realized none of this mattered to him. For it was not knowledge or even power that he had been seeking, but happiness. Perhaps his goal had not been to understand, but to let go. What no do you mean this game? Didn't we just go, beat this game, do, Wolfgang? How to feel. Whatever life he lives, Are you saying there's more endless. to this game? And that was all he needed to know. It was perhaps just out in the, the middle of nowhere, kind of. Stanley stepped through the open door. Is that what we're calling it? A door? Cuz no offense, that looks kind of flat as hell. Stanley felt the cool breeze upon his skin. We the did feeling it. of liberation, the immense possibility oh, of the new path before him. Sorry, I'm just going to keep referencing exactly other games as well, but I love right this game, now, don't get me wrong. The things were meant to happen. And Stanley was happy. Skyrim is good, but if you like Skyrim, Morrowind's pretty good. Soldier 76's ass. Oh god, I remember. I'm having war flashbacks of his negative ass. We did it! We beat the game! So that's the Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe. I really like how they improved the. I'm gonna. Yeah. All of his co-workers were gone. Any computers what I can turn off? Mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. That is my goal in this. I need to turn off all the computers I can access. He went around touching every little thing in the office, but it didn't make a single difference, nor did it advance the story. Wait, hello? Way. What do you mean input received? Eh? What do you mean? Uh, uh. Stanley clicked on literally every single door in the office because he doesn't pick up well on I'm on a mission, sir. You can't do this to me. Gross. You can't do this to me. When Stanley <laughs> blaze it. two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Oh no. Damned if I do, damned if I don't. I will not respect This was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. I could turn off that computer. Can I? I want to turn off that computer. Please. Let me go back to the weed number. Ah, yes. Truly a room worth admiring. It had really been worth the detour after all, just to spend a few moments here in this immaculate, beautifully constructed room. I want to drink Stanley eat. simply stood here. Drinking it all in. I want a drinky. I want a sippy. Sorry, I just noticed that plant and it's like. Yes. Really, really worth it. It's a very nice room. room, you know? A room so utterly captivating that it's even pretty wonderful. All it's your pretty nice. workers have mysteriously vanished, here you sit looking at these chairs and some paintings. Oh, to be fair, really I was. Worth. I was looking at the plant because it looked like one of those, like, Gmod plants, and I was like, ooh. Oh, it's way nicer than the meeting room. At this point, uh, Stanley's obsession with this room rude. brought it on creepy. Get fucked, meeting room. It poorly, but at last, he'd had enough of the amazing room and took the first open door on his left to get back to business. Sir, I need to... I could go through, but there's stairs down there. Ooh, what's in there? But what if I... Am I able to go back? No, he closed the door on me. Unless... JK, JK, unless... Uh, I forgot something in the break room. 
please? I need a sippy. I want to crack open a cold one with none of the boys. And so he detoured through the maintenance section, walked straight ahead to Bonk. the opposite door, and got back on track. I saw the red. You can't stop me. But Stanley didn't want to go back to the office. He wanted to wander about and get even further off track. Sir? So now in order to get back, he needed to go, um, uh, 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 left. Being a DM like. Can't open any of the doors. Oh, no. No, oh, it's sorry. to the right, my mistake. No, uh, you sure? Fine. No, 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 not the right. Why would I have ever said it was to the right? What was I thinking? It's clearly. Oh dear, would you hold on for a minute, please? No, you're good. Take your time. I'll just, uh... Now, let's see. We went down right, left, down, left, right. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Okay, okay, yes. I've got yeah, now. Yeah, yeah, we're good. This story is absolutely, definitely this way. Yay! I was wondering if one of... You sure? It looks like I'm about to get run over. Oh, that way. Hello? Can I drive? Please? Oh, wow. Rude. No, 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 no. Yeah, no, I'm not no, supposed no, to be no, here no, yet. No, this isn't right at all. You're not supposed to be here yet. This is all a spoiler. God, Quick, fucking... Stanley, close your eyes. Mark it. Okay, 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 okay. We just, we just have to get back to, um... Oh, who am I kidding? It's all rubbish now. The whole story completely unusable. No. How about, rather than waste my time trying to salvage this nonsense, We'll just restart the game from the beginning. And this time, no, suppose you we can, don't want us to so salvage far it. Okay. It's from a little bit sketchy. Oh. Man, this guy is a little bit railroady, I will be honest. Wait a second. I didn't even set my time properly. Oh, man. Rude. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Okay. So we're doing this, uh... We're doing this Nancy Drew style where we're gonna go through all the, the uh... All the potential routes. I'm trying to do better! He just doesn't respect my work ethics! When Stanley... Oops. Wait. Wait, what? No, I... No, I restarted. I swear, I definitely restarted the game over, completely fresh. Everything should be... Oh, did something change? Uh-oh. Stanley, did you change anything when we were back in that room with all the monitors? No. Did you move the story somewhere or... Uh... Hold on. Why am I asking you? I'm the one who wrote the story. It was right here just a minute ago. Double check. I know for sure that it's here somewhere. Okay, then. It's an adventure. Come, Stanley. Let's find the story. Ooh, let's, let's go this way. Hello? Oh, that's not good. Story? Clock? Wait, window? Painting. Hello? Oh god, oh god, oh god, it's so bright. Hello? I'll say it. This is the worst adventure I've ever been on. I can promise you there definitely was a story here before. Well... Do we just... Do we need to restart the game again? Let's look a little bit oh, longer. I it unlikely that we'll ever progress by starting over and over again. Is it in here? But it's got to be better than this. Okay, let's give it a shot. No! Why not? Aww. It's not my fault you wrote it to be in an office, dude. Okay, let's try All this again. All of his again. co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. What do you mean I didn't do better? I didn't do shit! I wanted to do shit. This time, 
this is the run. This is the run where everything is okay. Okay, yep, it's <sighs> worse. I might be remembering this wrong. It's possible the story is back where we just came from. Okay. Why don't we go back the other direction and see if we missed anything. Let's go. Anything in there? It's a collaborative adventure now. Aha! Wait. I should have read that. Aha, blaze it. Knowing your city. Hello? Uh, huh? No? Aha! I knew we'd miss something. The story. Here it comes. Why does this look like it's the lounge? Oh. No, wait, never mind. Not the story. Okay, let's head back the other way and retrace our step. Okay, okay. So... Are you just gonna close this up on me? Okay, good. Okay. Well... This isn't promising. It's actually a little bit... Now this... Well, I'll fight be honest, or flight? I don't recognize this place at all. Is this the story? No, this is I a murder so. shack, sir. I can't quite recall, but I believe my story took place in an office building. It, is that correct? Yeah. Hmm. Do you remember, Stanley? But... Well, do you know what? Since I've completely forgotten what we were supposed to be doing, how about this? This might be a fun story. You win! Congratulations! I know you put in a lot no, of No, I didn't work. break it. it I really won, Wolfgang. So, good job. Thank you. Oh, no. Oh. no. I don't feel right about this. No, at don't all. listen to him. I we won. Both know you didn't put in any actual work. No, for that win. listen, Some I won. Win fair and square, and this was not one of those situations. Rude. Okay, I'm getting weirded out by whatever this place is. I don't care what might happen this time. I have. Wait, to no. Restart. Oh, where's the door? Ah. Ah, but this is a little right. bit railroady. This time, to make sure we don't get lost, I've employed the help of the Stanley Parable Adventure Line. He's making just some good points, but like... How simple is that? Shh. Let me just turn everything off first. Uh, I don't think that's correct, actually. I'm trying. I'm sorry. I don't mean to deviate from the adventure line. I just need to solitaire. Turn it off. <sighs> Some people are beyond saving. 4B6. Are we in the basement now? You see? <laughs> the line knows Narrator where the story dabbers. Is. It's over in this direction. Onward, Stanley, to destiny. Though, here's a thought. Wouldn't wherever we end up be our destination, even if there's no story there? Yeah. Or to put it another way, is the story of no destination still a story? Yeah. Simply by the act of moving forward, are we implying a journey such that a destination is inevitably conjured into being via the very manifestation of the nature of life itself? Okay, Stanley, I need to follow this train of thought for a minute. Just stick with me. Okay. Now we can both agree that the nature of existence oh, is in bye, fact bye, a byproduct of one subjective experience Have fun of that lurking. existence, right? Okay. Now, if my experience of your existence rests inside of your subjective experience of this office, okay. is this office in fact the skeleton of my own relative experiential mental subjective construct? Whoa, 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 whoa. That's a lot of big words for you, sir. That got a bit weird back there. Well, I'd like to apologize. Not sure where I was going with all that. You know what? I think what we need right now is a bit of music to lighten the mood. Ooh. Uh. I'll have my best fun being Stanley. Does it ever change, actually? I'll check that out. Sorry, I was reading the words on the clock. Oh yeah, we be grooving. Oh, that 
that spooky. Go back and look at that fern. Sorry? Stanley, so? this fern will be very important later in the story. Make sure you study it closely and remember it carefully. You won't want to miss anything. I think he's lying to me. Okay, I'm gonna say that's good, sir. I'm gonna... No more music? Just, oops. Wait, what? We're back at the office? No. Procedurally no, no. generated line. adventure line. You're looking for the Stanley Parable, right? The story? Is any of this ringing a bell? Maybe. Aha! We found it. Oh, no, 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 not again. Line, how could you have done this to this us? This is the and story. After, we trusted you, after everything we've been through, you. Oh, I can't take this anymore. To hell with it. Restart. But that's the story. You should be a bit clear this time. Hold up. Just really, just give me a moment. I am not totally watching the hands on the clock to see if the big hand and the little hand move. If they do, it's very minuscule, but I'm gonna say that they don't. But it's okay, the minute one works and that's pretty impressive. Let's try this again. Hello? Sir? You know what, Stanley? I say forget the adventure line. What's it ever done for us? We're intelligent people, right? Why can't we make up our own story? Something exciting, daring, mysterious. Ooh, yeah. Oh, yeah. This all sounds perfectly doable. Why don't we simply start wandering in, well, I don't know. How about this direction? That one? Okay. I mean, hey, I'm a very willing, pliable D&D yes, &D player. This is exciting. Just me and Stanley forging a new path, a new story. Well, it could be anything. What do you want our story to be? Go wild. Use your imagination. I like it might be, how Stanley, you said mystery. I'm ready for it. I'm down with that. Or is this what Stanley's... Ooh. Oh, no. Oh. Not you again. Stanley, I'd also like to veto the line from having any role in our awesome new story. No lines or monitor rooms. Just don't acknowledge it. It's trademark. Fun. There's no way I can't acknowledge it because it's just right here, sir. It wants to be followed. Look what you've done. You've created a line and it's got dependency issues. Ooh! Ah, a choice. A round we room. Get to make a decision. From here, the story is in our control. How important we mustn't squander the opportunity. In fact, I believe I need a minute to think here. Just walk in circles for a minute. Like for one okay. minute? Okay, so I know that each door has to lead somewhere, which means that somewhere at the place where we're trying to go, there must be a reverse door that leads here. I think he's overthinking it. turn means that our destination corresponds with the counter-inverted reverse door's origin. So starting from the right... Me thinking about questions taking the right door that my players ask me. And since the answer is clearly yes, then by all accounts, the door on the right is the correct one. Another victory for logic. Come, Stanley. Our destiny awaits. This is an adventure. You shouldn't do logic. That's okay. You didn't miss much. I beat the game. And then I won, which was pretty nice. Hey, Gingy. Oh, hold 
Sarah. What's this? Ah. Oh. Hmm. The confusion ending. You're telling me that's what this is? It's all one giant After ending. a long time, Stanley died. The narrator is gone. Eight, eight Daddy, times? no. That's really how all this goes? It's all determined? So now, according to the schedule, I restart again. Then what? Am I just supposed to forget? Well, what if I don't want to forget? My mind goes blank simply because it's written here on this, this thing, wall. Well, who consulted me? Why don't I get to decide? Why don't I get a say in all of Do this? Do it. Is it really? No, it can't be. I, I don't want it to be. I, I don't want the game to keep restarting. I, I don't want to forget what's going Aww. on. I don't want to be trapped like this. I won't restart the game. I won't do it. I won't do it. I won't do it. Okay. Then that's... And the timer to... stopped. Let's let's go. Does that mean um, did we do it? Did we break the cycle? The um whatever it is that made this schedule. How would we even know? Will someone come for us? Will something happen? We should just leave, right? So. Okay. Come on, bud. I guess now we just wait. You know, I suppose in some way that this is a kind of story. Wouldn't you agree? I'm not quite sure if we're in the destination or the journey. Though they're always saying that life is about the journey and not the destination. So I hope that's where we are right now. We'll find out, won't we? Eventually. Well, in the meantime... If what? Sorry? Sorry? Does someone else have more control than the narrator does? Or is there like a time limit where it's like, oh shit, haven't beaten the game. Restart. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply- Poor guy, he's as much of a prisoner as I am. Can we go to the weed room yet? Tempting, but only because I don't know what might. If I see this door again, I'll take it, but for now, hmm. No new content. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Ah, uh, the door is reset, which is nice. This was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire Speed it. Speed running through the halls, like, hoof, hoof, wow. hoof. Yes, this room. What a beautiful room. What a gorgeous, gorgeous room. It's a bit dirty. Thank goodness Stanley had taken this deep, but eager to get back to Oop, business. Sorry. Stanley took the first open door on his left. Okay, so I did that last time. Let's go over here. Stanley was so bad at following directions, it's incredible he wasn't five years ago. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, this is cool. I don't want to accidentally die, though. It was dirty. It was a gorgeous room littered with empty cups. Okay, do not jump from it while it's in motion. Should I just go there, then, or...? I don't have a key card. Can I have a key card? Do I not get a key card? Aw. Okay. Look, Stanley, I think perhaps we've gotten off on the wrong foot here. No, I'm you're dirty, sure Wolfgang. Really, I'm not. I realize that investing in your trust in someone else can be difficult, but the fact is that the story has been about nothing but you all this time. No, I know. There's someone you've been neglecting, <gasps> Stanley. Adventure Someone Lion! Forgot I forgot about Adventure yes. Lion! Stop trying to make every decision by yourself. Now, I'm not asking for me. I'm asking for her. Hmm. This is it, Stanley. Your chance to redeem yourself. To put your work aside. To let her back into your life. Um. She's been waiting. I'm pretty sure that if I had someone, they would have existed in the happy ending. The friendly lion, the adventure lion. I want the adventure lion. I can't go anywhere else. 
That's her, Stanley. I don't... You need to be the one to do this. To reach out to her. If you can truly place your faith in another, then pick up the phone. But... This feels a little forced. He's trying to persuade me. I don't think I need... To be persuaded. Phone, a white light engulfed him. Filling him not just with radiance, yeah, but with no, hope. I'm all right, thank you. Hope for a life reunited one wait. Oh goodness. Stanley, did you just unplug the I wanna phone? get back to the story? No, that wasn't supposed to be a choice. How did you do that? You actually chose incorrectly. I didn't even know that was possible. Let me double check. I can crouch? Got him. No, it's definitely here, clear as day. Stanley picks up the phone. He's taken to his apartment where he finds his wife, and the two pledge themselves to one another. Music comes in, fade to white, roll credits. Sir? Not picking up the phone is actually somehow an incorrect course of action. How is that even possible? None of these decisions were supposed this to be This guy anything. would be a horrible I don't DM. Understand. How on earth are you making meaningful choices? What did you... Wait a second. Hmm? Did I just see... No, that's not possible. I can't believe it. How had I not noticed it sooner? Sorry? You're not Stanley. <gasps> You're a real person. It's me! <sighs> I can't believe I was so mistaken. Is this Stanley is not real? This able to make correct and incorrect choices. And to think I've been letting you run around in this game for so long. If you've made any more wrong choices, you might have negated it entirely. You have no it's idea, you sir. you completely ignored even the most basic safety protocol for real-world decision-making. Or did you not grasp the severity of the situation? Well, I won't have that kind of risk on my watch. Oh, I'm not again. i stop the game for a moment so we can educate you properly <sighs> on safe decision-making oh, in wait. the real world. So it's not a restart? Please observe this helpful instructional video. Choice. It's the best part of being a real person. But if used incorrectly, it can also be the most dangerous. For example, in this scenario, a hypothetical real person... Oh, this is so 50s. Look choice. at that tie. He could invent a machine that eliminates food shortages across the world to make life better for all Whoa. people. Ah. Or he could spend years of hard work forgetting how to read. Hold up, I'm checking real quick. Which what message choice is that? You make? Oh yeah. Remember that unlike here, the real world makes sense. That man has been no timed time out. Could you make a choice that does not conform to rational logic? That bot. If you find yourself speaking with a person who does not make sense, in all likelihood, SMH that person at the bots. is not real. Get good. Allow the person to finish their thought, then provide an excuse why you cannot continue talking. Turn to a partner and practice saying. My goodness, is it 4.30? They I'm were so close. They said 4.30. Uh, my goodness. Excellent. Oh. Making choices on a regular basis is the best part to a healthy decision Would you decision -making kiss an alligator? Process. Most I would. medical professionals recommend making at least eight choices Men per day. catalog. Do you make more than eight? Less? And finally, okay, let me you go begin to wonder if your choices yep. are actually meaningful and whether you'll ever make a significant contribution I, I to the world. Just remember that in the vast infiniteness of space, your thoughts and problems are materially insignificant, and the feeling should subside. At this, <laughs> this time, guy's your instructor face. will guide you in an exercise to test and reinforce the material. Want to be famous by these nuts? <gasps> Hot single milfs. Ah, welcome back. Oh. You may have noticed that this room has begun to deteriorate as a result of Oh god, I'm not forklift uh but not to worry. Now that you're properly informed I can't, good I can't, making, I can't. We're going no, to please. Revisit a choice you I'm made not forklift just a certified. Ago and see what the correct thing to do would have been. Please. This way, please. Well, thank you. Can I find the adventure line again? You got a pair of these nuts and a hot milf in your now area? If your choices are meaningful, we can't have you jumping off the platform and dying. Aw, thank you. Aw, adventure line's gone. Halfway through the story. That story would make no sense at all. Agreed. We just need to get you home as soon as possible before the narrative contradiction gets any worse. But I want a milf! It seems this place is not well equipped to deal with reality. Also, how much psychic damage will I do if I keep calling the narrator daddy? I'm hoping for at least a D6. Oh, 
Oh, we're back to this gorgeous, gorgeous room. Look at that. It's got a coffee cup on the ground. Oh, yes, Disgusting, the Wolfgang. The back to the correct ending. The story will have resolution once again, and you'll be home free in the real world. That could be me. But you play in. Okay. Now remember, all you need to do is behave exactly as Stanley would. That means choosing responsibly and always putting the story first. Probably I'm not going sure to work. Ah, no, Just I didn't. follow my lead and you'll be fine. All right. Okay. <clears throat> when Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Just checking. All righty, sir. I want the adventure line back in my life. We were having fun. Yet there was not a single person here either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's what office. What do people want? He might find an answer profit, there. profit, profit. Oh. I don't know what I do here at work, but this is a horrible workplace. Nah. I won't do the broom closet ending. Mostly because I- Oh yeah! Coming Aww! To the Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. But the sexy red basement! Where is it? You promised me the basement. And now you're removing the basement from me? Is it no longer a bathroom? Aw, man. Hello? Let's try to... Ah, oh, this looks awful. I preferred the other one. Stepping inside his manager's office, Stanley was once again stunned to discover oh, not God. an indication of any human life. Shocked, unraveled, Stanley Business wondered in strategy. disbelief who orchestrated this oh, until no. he saw the door with a voice receiver next to it. Panda Surely behind this gun. door lay all the answers to his questions. And beyond all probability, he knew the passcode. Oh, that's new. He had seen it on his boss's computer just last week. Night Shark 115. Was this the code to open the door? Would it still work? There was only one way to find Please out. Speak clearly? Stanley had been trained never to speak up, but now <gasps> he would draw from within himself I'm getting the courage. courage to face the unknown. He drew a sharp breath and then spoke the code. <gasps> Testing? Uh, is this thing on? Testing. <clears throat> Stanley spoke the code. Night Shark 115. Surely this he one actually into the receiver, work, right? Right there on the wall. Night Shark 115. Aha, it's a scam. Let's I'm get I'm sorry, is there a problem? Yeah. You didn't mishear me, did no? you? Please speak the code into I the tried. receiver. Otherwise we can't get on like with this? the story. This is a crucial step. I tried. Okay, fine. You're not going to do it, but you know what? It's pretty humiliating <sighs> to bring you this far, only for you to suddenly decide you have better things to do. I asked you for this one single I'm thing trying. for your respect. The kind of respect Stanley shows for his choices. He knows what it means I'm to take trying. a story seriously. If you didn't want to see what I had to show you, then why did you come here? You had a choice, Stop you know. Talking. You could have Stop gone talking. through the door on the right. You could have done whatever the hell Night you wanted shark over there. Why did one, you come this way? One, Speak. Five. Say something to me. Explain yourself, you coward. You... Yeah, it lied to me. Is behave exactly as Stanley would. That means I wanted to speak. And always I'm being silent. I'm quite sure you'll be up to oh, the I task. put my, my Just follow away. my lead and you'll be fine. All right. <clears throat> when Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Let's try this again. Maybe the office will be a bit fixed this time. Ugh. And this guy is calling me yet incompetent. Was a, there was not a single person here. Either. Sorry. Feeling a wave of dis. Uh oh. 
is behave exactly is behave exactly as oh, Stanley no! would. That means choosing responsibly and always putting the story first. I'm quite sure you'll be up to the task. S sir, just follow my lead and you'll be fine. All You're right. stuck in a loop. <clears throat> When Stanley came to a set of two open doors... Hurry, we gotta, like, speed run this. Door on his left. Come on, come on. Let's go, let's go. Hurry. Go, 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 go. Gotta rush. Yet there was not nope, a nope, not looking. Either. Boss appreciation Feeling minute. Wave nope. Of disbelief. Ah, shit. Is behave exactly as what are you talking board. about, Wolfgang? Choosing responsibly and I'm not breaking anything. I'm first. trying my best. I'm quite sure you'll be up to the task. This is bad user fine. experience. Right. Zero <clears throat> out of when ten. Stanley came to a set of okay, two come on. Open doors, he entered the Speed door run, let's go. Left. Okay, maybe this way's the best way to go? Yet there was not a single person here either. Feeling a wave of disbelief <sighs> is behave exactly as Stanley would. That means choosing responsibly and always no, putting the story okay, first. Please. I'm quite sure you'll be up to the task. Just follow my lead and you'll be fine. All right. <clears throat> when Stanley came to a set of two open doors... I think I found something interesting. I'm going to check left. real quick. I'm gonna listen. <laughs> Trying. <laughs> no. Is behave exactly as Stanley would. That means choosing responsibly. Damn, this band just straight up wants first. me to go down the wrong one, huh? Be up to the task. They don't just want me to be Stanley. Why don't they want me right. to be Stanley? <clears throat> when Stanley came to what a would set Stanley of do? He'd doors, keep going. He the door on his left. But what Cat has to do is she has to break the cycle. No! Why did oh. you do that? I'm Quickly, hurry back in the other direction. Perhaps we're not too late. Sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt you. Okay. Okay. Oh, it's ruined. You, I can't believe after everything we talked about that you, my story, you've destroyed I my work. Why? For what? He keeps what getting get mad at that? me. What did you think was so special about seeing the game undone? Left here like so much garbage. I was it's trying. Worth, it's worth this now. And what am I supposed to do? This guy's getting Even in if such a huff. Way to continue, would it be worth it? To know that my story is now incorrect? How can I go back to that? I can't erase that knowledge. I'll have to live with it forever. No, yeah, you can erase it. Let's just uh, erase it. Oh, I couldn't live that way. Is it better to shut the game down entirely? To willingly destroy all of my work? I don't know. What's the answer? The answer what is do do? to what go do left. Do? What do I... No, I have to. I have to shut the game down. <sighs> Gamer. I have to. I have to. You don't. Let's just reset the... <laughs> Sorry. Hello. Ew, I love Bendy and the Ink Machine. Oh, up. I'm here. I'm still here. Here in this pile of rubbish. I'm glad you're With still you. here. You who thought you were so clever. Oh. Now look where we are. My entire game is destroyed. It was the only thing in the world that was mine, and you've run it into the ground. I didn't do what, this. did you think that would be funny? You just had to see? Didn't I impress upon you how important it was to be like Stanley? I was Stanley? trying! He actually knows how to do what I tell him to. He understands that if I say to do something, a there's a damn guy. good reason for it. That thought hadn't even occurred to you, had it? That there's a uh. world outside of you? You're a child. Daddy, please. Uh -oh. My story. If you'd just gone through the door on the left, you would have seen I was it. trying was to go through the door. Facility. You would have destroyed it and been victorious. It would have been so perfect. I worked so hard on it. I tried so hard to make... When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Stanley? Hello? Are you... Is everything okay? 
Stan, please. I, I need you to make a choice. I need you to walk through the door. Are you listening to me? Can you hear me? Is everything all right? Stanley, this is important. The story needs you. It needs you to make a decision. It cannot exist without you. Do you understand me? Whatever choice you make is just fine. They're both correct. You cannot be wrong here. We can work together. I'll accept whatever you do. I simply need you to take that step forward, please. Choose. Do something. Anything. This is more important than you Kimmer, want to know. This is actually kind of sad. I need this. The story needs it. So, you hear me? Are you there? Are you listening to this? Stanley, are you there? Okay. It's okay, I can wait. You need time to decide. Time to make sure your choice is correct. That is the best choice. That's all right. You can't make me feel I things. Need you to decide what's the right thing to do. Take as much time as you need. Dude, why does the voice act acting fucking slap? Uh, thank you for resetting. I didn't want to close the game. <laughs> All of this co-workers. Daddy, I missed gone. you. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Ooh, I gotta keep doing it. That's what I gotta do. Okay, okay, okay. Delightful. Surname. Username. Access. Password. Let's try to get to the end of the game again. Oh, but I said I would go through the door. It's a new content. Oh. New content? Yeah. What does that mean? New content. I want to go that way. It means it's new. And it's content. Maybe this is Adventure Line back at it again? Oh, no, I'm going this way. Okay. Hello? Hello, and thank you for playing the Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe. Oh, the new content. As you may know, the Stanley Parable was a video game released in 2013 on home computers. I get it. After receiving critical and commercial success, it was expanded upon in 2022 with the Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe, a reimagining of the game for consoles and home computers. Hoggies. The Stanley Parable Ultra oh, God. features exciting new content that broadens and expands the world of the Stanley Parable, delighting audiences the world over. Please step inside and see what thrilling new adventures await in the Stanley Parable. New content? Ultra Hell Deluxe. yeah. Oh, well, this sounds delightful. I'm very excited Yay. to see the thrilling new Ultra Deluxe content. That makes two of us. Those papers are so bright. Damn. Okay, so far it's an elevator. Nothing special yet. You gotta be but patient. I'm sure it's just the beginning of a mesmerizing adventure. An adventure in an office? Oh no. Nah. Um, is it broken? What's going on? I here? am the new should content. We, should we be moving somewhere? Or, or, oh, there we go. All right, finally, at long last, it's on to the new He sounds content. more excited than I am. Be more ready. Let's do it. Might take a while, though, so... Uh... Hmm. Hmm. I have to say, initial impressions of Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe, mostly no, tedious. No, it's, it's too early it's to tell. From... Oh, okay. Let's see the content. Give me the content, Stanley. Dude, you're getting so hyped for this. Be careful. Ooh. All right. All right, let's I can see. jump? The jump circle? This is like dash con. <gasps> oh. Hold up. Hold up. 
Unplug it. I want infinite jumps. Please. Okay, okay. Crusty looking zero. Mm, thank you, I guess. Is, is that it? Surely that's not all the new content. There has to be something else, right? No, but it's hidden. Shh. Another My elevator. jumps? Stanley, I have to say. In My jumps are behind a paywall, Dabbers? No! It's just elevators and jumping. Is this what passes for exciting new content? No, but it passes as content. funny content. And I could just read you the whole dictionary. There's 20 hours of new content right there. Hell, I could count to 30 trillion. You could put that on the box. The Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe, now with over a thousand hours of new content. And it oh, wait. There's more. Very good. Yes. I knew there had to be something else. Let's Everyone is a critic. I'm ready for whatever it is. Uh. Hello? Aw, thank you! That's it? Oh, you've got to be kidding me. You see, Stan? This is what happens when greedy <laughs> video it? game developers with no respect for their fan base rush a cheap expansion to market for no reason other than to make an easy dollar. And don't get me started on the level of craftsmanship that's gone into it. In fact, I'm looking right now at the game's achievements, and it's hard to believe one of them actually says, Test achievement, please ignore. Dead what ass? quality assurance department signed off on this? I'm infuriated yeah. and I'm Test offended. achievement I, description. I Replace this. On Twitter oh, and hold that's them cute. Personally accountable. <sighs> it's my fault, Stanley. I built up too much anticipation around the new content, I'm afraid. It could never have lived up to such expectations. If you're still with me, why don't we just reset the game and we'll try to get back to what the Stanley parable is really about. No frills, no gimmicks. Just you and me having a Aww. great time together. Like Although, always. to be fair, a lot of this game what is just say, gimmicks. Friend? Yeah. Oh. But what if I said no and you still reset it? Ooh. This looks a bit new, sir. Or uh, accidental. Let me go back. I need to... To the computer. Psst. Stanley, come over here. In the vent. I want to show you something. Is that a... Oh, I thought it was a card. Hold up, I just want to check over here real quick. Just gonna... Wait, you wouldn't want me to... Okay. If you don't want me to follow the story, you must be showing me something good. Coffee nut. I want that mug. I want a mug that says coffee nut. I want that. I want that so badly. Woo. I would pay money. Please make that merch. Please devs, please I'll buy it. Give me a blue mug that says coffee okay. nut and I will drink coffee from it. The new ultra deluxe content turned out to be Well, it got me thinking about the past and how much Ooh. better the Stanley Parable used to be. So I made something special and tucked it away here where the game's Ooh. developers won't find it. <gasps> Just our little secret. Take a look. Oh, I love Dark Souls and also you made this for me? It's for me? That's a little gay. I love it. I call it the memory zone. It's where I've been storing all my favorite memories so I can Wait, relive can, the peak you experiences can't have memories, of my though. life whenever I want. Experiences no, that's the valid. of the you can Stanley like Dark Souls, on Swaggy. PC. I'm just not good at it. Ooh. Ooh, basket. Oh, that's cute. We can go on picnics. 
You see, Stanley, doesn't the memory zone remind you of how wonderful Stanley Parable was before it was solid with a cheap re-release? Remember back in October of 2013, when the game originally launched? I mean, back yeah. Then, video Is he a computer? Because he just feels like back a program. Then, it all meant something. Oh, the waste. I like how they shaded it so that it's, like, nostalgic, too. Oh, you get it? It's 2013? <laughs> oh, this is quaint. I like it. Oh. The memories zone temp? I remember. <laughs> this is cute. Oh, Firefox. Delightful. I want that mug. Oh, that's me. <laughs> Ooh. I like that vibe. That's very nice. Take a look, see. That's a foot. Oh, official sound. Ooh. I mean, that's fair. I've never. Our first dollar. I've never, like, actively listened to the soundtrack. I want to begin the demo. It won't let me. Eh? Aw. Why would I want to start the game again? Ah, uh, this was the one that people were talking about. The achievement that you get after not playing the game for five years. I don't know about this but this guy. I wouldn't be surprised if he was unachievable. Nice. Nice, good for them. Beta, work in progress. Is that me and my wife? My wife. Hmm. I don't know if I'd believe that, but that seems pretty cool if true. <gasps> this is a little baby, little Stanley. What animal is that? Its mouth looks like a cat. Its ears and eyes look like a gerbil of sorts. I'm Zowie. I don't know what little Stanley is. Oh, this is delightful. That's just a piano. And over here is where I keep reviews of the Stanley Parable. Like this stunning triumph of games journalism, 10 out of 10 from Destructoid.com. <laughs> James Stephanie Sterling writes, and I quote, We're so many games that aspire to be more than games end up less than any form of art. Stanley Parable strives and then succeeds to be every game ever created. Did you hear that, Stanley? Every game ever created. There's only one That's game and it is the Stanley Parable. The original Stanley Parable was. It was literally every game ever created. Skyrim, Persona it Skyrim. 3. It was Persona 3. Oh, wow. It was all of them. And now, it's nothing. It's no games at all. What do you mean? It isn't even the Stanley Parable anymore. It's just a husk now. A lifeless husk. Dude, take off the rose-colored glasses. It's fine. You can cope. Oh, he changed it. Hey, that's not Stanley Parable. Unless it was Stanley Parable. I don't know if they actually had a bit in the original Stanley Parable that was Portal. Yeah, this guy, like, he's clearly got some issues with the jump circle. Oh, buttons. Is this the sexy basement? I don't wanna, I don't wanna ruin his vibe. It's fine. 
We'll leave it be for once. Here's another moving passage, oh. this time from GameSpot.com. The Stanley Parable is both a richly stimulating commentary I on the, the jump of choice in games it gave and me one that offers an outlet some of the most enjoyable, surprising, and rewarding choices I've ever been confronted with in a game. Nine out of ten. Don't you get it, Stanley? The game was perfect. It didn't need anything else. It didn't need new content. It just needed to be left alone. To spend the rest of time collecting dust in the hallowed hall of beloved video game memories. It's not... no, it's fine. Ooh. Where do I go now? <sighs> you okay? These were simpler times, Stanley. But I wouldn't give to go back to have it all over again. Wait, hang on. I don't recall this part of the memory zone before. What's this? What's down here? Do you want to... Oh, no! It's the trash oh, no. zone. Oh, God, no. Stanley, it's a collection of reviews from <laughs> Steam, the <laughs> online Steam. video game distributor. I haven't looked at these in years. I can't even imagine what's been collecting down it's here. It's a lot of Steam reviews. Surely these reviews were glowing as well, weren't they? Ruh -ruh. <gasps> imagine just like not liking the game and Honestly, being immortalized in the fucking game. game. Oh, that's so good. The is obnoxious and unfunny. With his humor and dialogue, you leave him alone. The narrator is a delight, um, and he's got funny. such a good I'm ass. Funny. Oh, sorry. I'm trying to make a serious work of art. No, but what about this I one? I suppose I could write up a handful of gags one? to insert into the Stanley Parable, but the game is already such a densely layered web of profound philosophical insights that I can't even imagine where I'd have the room to stick them. It's like a graveyard. The quarry of bad reviews. Uh oh. Where are all the good ones? You know there are good ones. I'm sorry we had to go down here, man. Here's one. Uh oh. Here's another. Okay, let's see what this one says. Don't look at the red ones. Well, the idea for the game is good. Mm -hmm. For someone who prefers non-linear games, this preachiness gets annoying. They call it vaporized preachy. water. Oh, Stanley, that's so funny. I'm not preachy, am I? You can tell me if I'm preachy. Honestly, you can. Oh goodness, this is actually quite shocking for me. I, I always, well, to be honest, I had always thought. No, of girl, don't even think about it. Terse, to begin with. You're sexy as you hell. How much you got a good I dumpy. You just want to have a good time. You well, may be a bit railroady. But maybe it wasn't. Oh dear. What an awful memory to have to hold on to. These black marks are my otherwise unimpeachable track record. No, but like the good I stuff. Feel like a failure. No. Like I let these people down. No. Perhaps the Stanley Parable isn't quite as sterling as I always remembered. Nothing ever is. Poor guy. Oh, it's a soggy area down here. Eh. What's this one got to say? Do, 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 do. You constantly have to stop doing anything so the narrator can catch up with his long-winded explanations of what's happening. I mean, you don't have I to. I wish there was a skip button. Aww. A skip button. Aww. Well, well, yes. I'm not yes, gonna do a skip do button. I'm not if gonna. I'm truly too preachy then. Then maybe letting you skip ahead for I'm just a moment. I'm not gonna do that to you. Help. Not if it means we can strike these negative reviews from the record. Only no, positive reviews no. of the Stanley Battle. That's my motto today, and it's always been my motto. I'd do anything for the customer, Stanley. Oh? Yes, a skip button we shall Anything have. you say? Uh, 2023 sexy Stanley calendar win? I don't want to use the skip button, though. Let me just go over here real quick. Just okay. Oh. I don't wanna. 
Can I just go back? I don't wanna... And here it is. Go ahead and give it a sh- I'll pop you forward in time so that the second my incessant droning starts to bore you, with just the push of a button, you'll have zipped right past it. It's the what time the actually changed. And I'm very proud to have delivered. No more listening to me rambling on and on and on. No, 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 no. The Stanley Parable is a game for the people. And if the people want silence, then by goodness, that's what they're going to get. Well, don't sit around waiting for me to shut up. Go ahead and make me shut up. Oh. Here, we'll pretend that I've just begun an interminable monologue. And it goes something like this. The story and the choices or what have you. And therefore, by becoming it is, a delight? so on and so forth. Until inevitably, we all until the end of time. At which time, everything all at once. So, now you see, blah, 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 blah. We've eaten too much and it can't be just yet. No, no, until two hundred and forty-five. Damn, he just enjoys saying things, huh? Give me a second. I just, I'm interested in this. He's got a lot of buzzwords up his sleeves. Ten thousand years. Until just yesterday, here and there, forward and back, and never a moment before lunchtime. It can't be. It's the only thing there is. How many billions left until so much more than forever ago? Which is why I say the story and the choices. And now he's just repeating. And therefore, by becoming it is, so on and so forth. Got until him. Inevitably, we all until the end of okay, time. Okay, so the time is changing time, now. Okay. At once. So, we just, now uh... you see, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Okay, skipped a few minutes. Back, you Hi. You were only frozen in time for a few minutes, but it was plenty of time for me to deliver a long rambling monologue full well, of unnecessary <sighs> verbal flourishes and many Sir, I find fault in your logic. Of choice in video games. Of course, I happen to believe it was perhaps one of my more profound such ruminations. No, it wasn't. Not that, of course, you need a description of it, but if I had to describe it, I'd say it was perhaps less of a rumination and more of a treatise. Or maybe a manifesto. It was garbo, Look, dude. I'll outline it for you very briefly and you can tell me what you think. Okay, so my theory is that any choice you've ever made is simply a series of choices made by the person who you are or were or will be at the time of having made said choice. That is to say, if by articulating a choice you've already made, you okay. bring that choice into being, then by making no choice and saying nothing, are you not simply erecting in <laughs> the sanctuary he of said time erecting. a monument to every person you've ever I'm 12, been, by the way. every choice to which you've ever given your great gift of mortal and yet timeless thought? Or rather, do all of the choices you've ever made, in fact, make you more not this kind of person, and in fact, do the very opposite? You see, it could in fact be both of these things at once. That you uh, are both pasta with the dad jokes. And hey! Choices, and that they are both Welcome! You and Happy Friday! You at the same time We've beaten the game a few the times. There was one ending where I got credits and it made okay, me really first, sad. I was leaning towards manifesto. Uh, now and now I we're around and slap the treatise label on this one. Dealing with much more of a, a skip vibe. button? Because he read through the Steam reviews of the previous game and was like, oh shit, people don't like me talking so much. I'm doing well, thank you. I'm thinking that in a few minutes or at the next reset, I'm gonna go uh, heat up some lunch for me real quick and then I will be back. But that'll be in the next reset. I don't know how long that's gonna be. In repeated succession until I become sick of one or the other. Okay, in which so case, the word I am not this is where he's saying he's mystery. gonna do the reset. It is an or not the reset, the, it's rescued me from disaster the in looping. Situations. All right, here we go. Go for it. Treatise, manifesto. Repeating. Treatise, manifesto. Treatise, manifesto. Treatise, manifesto. Treatise. Manifesto. Treatise. I like how they manifesto. use the same treatise, treatise. but they have manifesto. slight variation on manifesto. Treatise. Manifesto. Heated up the Cinco de Mayo burger. <laughs> nice. <laughs> well, there, sport. You really did catch me rambling on a bit, didn't? But that's the power of the. Button. I feel bad using the it. I start to go off on a thoughtless display of self-absorption. What's in the burrito? Go poof, and it's all over. Did I say oh, burger? I can't My wait bad. To see what Cookie Nine will say about this. And whether Damn, imagine being called out by this game. Review, or at least I mean, they probably wouldn't play it, but... Perhaps. To be honest, I don't even know if one can change their review in the first place. See? I guess I should become better educated on exactly how Steam works. Oh, it's called Vaporized perhaps Water that Edition? that would have been the smart thing to check on before I went about this whole exercise of making the skip button. Yeah. 
Although I have to imagine that after seeing this exciting new technology at work, surely whoever it is runs Steam will instantly run out and implement a new feature to make it possible to edit one's review, merely because of this very situation. Yes, I, I mean, think that's quite it'd likely. be nice, but who knows? Or perhaps they'll simply grab this Bryce particular Black Beans, user Pico. the ability Pico to change their review. so good. What's your so problem, gamer? Maybe you're just not into it right no, now, which is I valid. Would even be okay with Grill the shrimp? Ooh, grilled so shrimp burrito. Something more beneficial. Something uh, along the lines of, this game is something the best. Something happened. I need to double check to make sure everybody's all right. So I think this will be a good time for me to also uh, yum yum on some food chins. So... Give me a moment. I'll be right back. Let's get back to the game for a little bit. If he starts rambling, I can just om nom nom nom. I don't want to eat the cardboard. I also do not want to burn my mouth. Game. <laughs> hmm. Let me start over. I don't want. How about to, this? It, it. From the from the ashes of depravity rises the phoenix of quality. How oh, else to describe the Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe? Cargborb, I Such eat it. Such a revolutionary step forward in the lineage of one of the most beloved Soggy video game properties of all so time. Good. The additions oh, go, 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 and changes go. made to this expansion will Is this a good ending? resonate in the annals it makes of the history of all media ever It makes me feel bad because he's like, It is perhaps true to no say one that like no me, and I'm like, no, gamer. Stone, for the stone into which the Stanley Parable was carved has itself been transmuted. Offering a message of hope to I those who have ever sandwich, heard in their judgment. I want to eat my sandwich, but it's warm. You are not beyond redemption. You may change. Aww. And you may become more, so much more than you were before. That's if there me. Is any message to I can do that. The Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe, it is this. Warmth. A privilege. I feel the warmth in my hands, and it smells like it microwave the chicken. Oh no, that means that the lettuce and the tomato are microwaved too. There is time for us to become oh, no, our greatest selves, as, our as great as we ever could dream of in our wildest, most ambitious <laughs> visions <laughs> for a brighter future. <laughs> wow! Now, Stanley, that's a review. It is. It's, it's perfect. It's the perfect review. It's the review I've always dreamed. Do you of think someone used that review on Steam? I, well, I have to read it again. Mm -hmm. It's simply too wonderful. I have to experience this just one more time. From the from the ashes oh, of he the interrupted planet, himself. Rises. Okay, welcome back, Stanley. Now I should say that the amount of time the button has been skipping through is becoming longer and longer. That last one was well, I want to say maybe 30, 45 uh -oh. minutes. Uh-oh. It's not Unendurable Maybe we shouldn't means, do the skip button well, then. There's really only so much I can ramble on to myself about. I don't want to leave you alone. Shocking, it? But at any rate, I do suggest that we not press the button again. Okay. I think the skip button has been aptly demonstrated, and we can say goodbye to it and just... Wait, how do we get out of here? Where did the door go? Oh, shit. Wasn't there a door that led into Hold this up. room? I'm on I it. I feel quite certain that there was one here before. How else would we have gotten into the room in the first place? Oh no. I don't think one can enter a room without a door. Can you make a door sort, for me? A window or something like Do you see a window anywhere? A port? I can go into the fan. A sufficiently large crack in the wall. I'll take any of these. All I want is for us to move on and to please step away from the skip. Burrito gone. Wow, that was quick. Than the skip was I'm a, a big fan before, of mayonnaise flavored so warm cardboard. But only if it's a spicy just mayonnaise. Ran your way through a wall. Is there any possibility that you could, say, slam your body into the wall until enough damage is done for you to be able to leave? Please, I don't I'll know, take I'm any trying. option at all. I'm asking you to work I'm trying. I, we need a door. We he need doesn't want to be sometime. left alone. I can work with any kind of door as long as it can open I'll and have lead burrito. from one room to another. Valid. I'm, I'm going to step away for just a moment, and I'm going to try to find us a door. I don't know how exactly to remove a door and place it in a different wall, but I will the plain find a way. I warm promise. cardboard. You just need to not do anything. Don't press the skip button. Please, please, please do not press the skip button. Just wait here. Okay, give me. Wait here for me, and don't press the skip button. I've got it. Okay. Yes. Good. Okay. I'll be right back. Take your time. I'm gonna eat some more warm cardboard. But honestly, that sounds like it was a delicious burrito pasta. I'm a sucker for shrimp. Shrimp is so good. Although I'm not a fan of fish. I like the shellfish, but I don't like the non-shelled fish.
low calorie cardboard. Oh, I get that gluten free. I'm a little bit disappointed that they haven't been able to make a uh, warm cardboard uh, that was uh, good for those that are lactose intolerant. It's a bit disappointing, but I can understand that it might take them a little bit of time because cardboard is the way it is, right? I'm going to take a bite real quick, but I'm starting to get the feeling he's not going to come back, which is a little bit sad. Ha, ha. Sandwich. I'm trying to wait for him. I don't want to wait for years. Oh, Wolfgang, you waited for a while. I'm sorry. You tried so hard. Okay, so interestingly enough, the minute hand is moving. Sorry for what, you didn't say if he comes back. I'm assuming he doesn't come back because the point is to press the button. Just like how all of his other monologues started repeating themselves, the point was to press the button. Maybe you can get your mail after the stream. Please. I don't want him to be left alone. Man, he's taken a while, huh? It's been at least two minutes. No, I'm just saying, like, you can use the end of the stream as your little uh, call to action to be like, okay, I gotta go check my mail now. Please? How long do you want me to wait? I don't... Uh, I don't want to hurt the man. He's been so hurt already. Those reviews. But also, even if he does come back... Because the area, hello? Because the area does not reload, I will not be able to get a door. So, whoop. I'm sorry, dude. Stanley, Stanley, Stanley. Stanley, please don't push the button Holy again. Shit. It's been 12 hours. You've just been frozen. I know, there. I'm sorry. Please I get rid of it. The skips are getting longer, but they're really, truly getting longer. And my God, there's no way out of the room. Stanley, the door is gone. It's completely gone. I've looked at it from every angle. I've checked every one of those walls a thousand times. And there's no door, Stanley. There's no door. There's just you and the button, and if you keep pressing it, I have no idea. But what, what else will are we happen. supposed to do? I have no idea how long I'll be made to sit here, and more than anything else, I don't know how to stop you from pressing the button again. Get rid of it. I can't control anything. Did the lights go off? I can't touch, and I have to believe. I have to know that sooner or later, no matter how much I plead with you, you're going to press the button again. Why would you? I've been thinking because and I thinking. Can't and I, do I don't anything know what else. I can do to convince you otherwise. Get me oh out of here. God. And it's all because of those reviews. Those reviews that I couldn't get out of my mm -hmm. head. I just couldn't mm -hmm. ignore the negative feedback. Ignore Why the haters, it so gamer. It's important for me to fix the problem. 
Why did Cookie Nine's opinion like matter so much to me? I like how he keeps bringing up Cookie Nine. I've never met Cookie Nine. I have no idea who hey, they I'm are. Hey, I'm gonna listen to him, Wolfgang. Really matter. Shush. But here I am. I'm fixating on every tiny negative thing that anyone ever says about the merest mention of one of my imperfections. But also because he has a point. A he child. needs this Wild moment of self-reflection. I can't stop myself from lashing out with a vengeful fury to alter and to change and to break anything unbroken if only it pleases this one person who made a single negative. Wait point. a second. Oh, okay. I thought there was no more chicken in, in my sandwich. What benefit is this? And here I am, now stuck in a room, waiting for you to press this button. Aww. Become frozen in time, knowing that you're going to do it, and that I'm going to be stuck all alone, and that I had the power to prevent it all from happening. Oh if no! Only I held my tongue. It's all out of my control now. Just you. Oh no! Just your decision. Yeah, exactly sandwich better fucking have some suffer. chicken. I am not just eating alone. warm soggy Surely cardboard you. sandwich with I no meat. It. Surely you'll press that button again, mm -hmm. leaving me here. And surely you'll put your own desire to see what's next ahead of my need for company, for companionship. This? Surely you'll not be moved by my howls of fitful anxiety that you sit with me and just stay here. Oh, no, no, no. I know you. This man well. doesn't know me. me. You don't oh know God. me. And, it's all and now he's those repeating reviews. himself. Those reviews that I couldn't get out of my head. I just couldn't ignore the negative feedback. Why was it so important Ugh. for me? I'm sorry, dude. Oh, Stanley, you're back. It's been years. Oh my goodness, I have someone to talk to again. Stanley, I, I think it's been a week. Oh, that the. Or two weeks. I've been sitting here all that time. Aww. Just sitting here. Not a single person to speak with. I want the door back. That I don't. Just how it's always been, right? Buddy. Me talking and you saying nothing. Would you think that it's exactly the same as always? Doesn't that feel like what we've already been doing? Me just talking? All the lights burn out in two weeks. Maybe it's been around for it longer. Isn't even close because I know you can't hear me once you push that button. That's I what I'm know. realizing. Understand. I'm realizing this is suffering. That I needed to know that someone was listening. I needed there to be a vessel through which my words were moving. Can I just like leave through the vessel fan? I needed Stanley. Not yeah, that. they're like I'm just cheap the prop bones. None of that matters anymore. I'll give it all up. I'll give Aww. up every branching path. I'll burn my story to the ground. One single thing I need, and God, I can see now that I need it more than anything, is to know that Ooh, someone buddy. else is taking it in. These words that I'm saying, I need to know you can hear me. Because maybe, Stanley, maybe, if you Aww, can hear me, then poor maybe guy. it means I'm real. Maybe I'm not just a fiction. Was I scared of that? I want life? to. It makes me uh -huh. sad, yeah. but... I like Perhaps to. I've been scared this whole time that if I stop speaking, I'll slip backwards into the silence and be consumed. I don't know why this lighting is like this. I can't be taken by it, Stanley. I can't lose myself in the stretch of emptiness between you and me. Stay when strong. You press that button. You're still right. He's not there, rambling. You're so tremendously far away, and in those moments, the emptiness folds itself outward in between the two of us, and I am suspended in its unyielding quietness. Ooh. I can feel the edges of my reality curdling. I'm gonna listen to him. I can tell and that eat I am sandwich. becoming less and less real. Oh, buddy. Yet to speak to you now, I am alive. I am truly and I feel so here. I am there is gift. no fern. I am someone. I am something. I am being listened There's to. There's this dead little tree over here, but he's just the vibing. The emptiness between us has collapsed, and I feel right now like I am not a worker. No fixed. problem, Wolfgang. See you in a bit. Occupy space in this world again, and I have cast a shadow onto the wall. You see what I'm saying, don't you? You can see what this means to me. I'm so clear about it now, Stanley. I feel as certain about this as I've ever felt about anything at all. I feel okay. renewed. I feel restored, and already I can sense the looming silence as you will press the button for the next time. What a terrible dread it's Aww, I don't want to, to though, think, gamer. To think of returning to such coldness. Come, let us sit in silence together here for just a moment. Let us anticipate it. Okay. Let us welcome it. Let us not run from it. It felt like he wanted to say more with the end of that sentence, but he didn't. So I'm just going to take another bite of my sandwich. Ah. 
warm tomato. Yeah, friend hasn't changed. Sorry, gamer. That's okay, that's okay. I'm giving him a, mo a moment of silence. And then we'll press the button once more. I can only imagine how long it'll be. Years. Decades. Eons. Oh, hello. It's you. You're here again. Welcome. I have had time to think about you and about us and about everything. Oh, damn, it's been so long. The I've clock stopped. So much time. I stopped keeping track after a year. Holy I shit. Sat down Why is it so one bright? Place and not move for one entire year. Let me describe it for you. To begin with, there is only regret. There is only the turning wheel of missed opportunities. I felt nothing at all but regret for the Aww. longest time, Stanley. Days, months. I lost it all in a blur of the deepest longing to undo the past. And when that feeling had begun to subside, what took its place is what I can only describe as the collapse of every moment Aww, I have ever buddy. experienced my That's entire rough. life. All of them collapsed down into a single instant. In that instant, I could see myself clearly, calmly, with a collected heart. It was an impossibly rich wellspring of both delight and disgust. Simultaneously, I was consumed by it. I could do nothing but wallow in it for what felt like an eternity, for what I now know was far less. You see, it was a revelation for me. It was unlike anything I had ever known. It was a space without consequence, without action or outcome. It was divorced entirely from the question of free will that you and I have squabbled over for so long. There could be no one ending, no singular outcome of events, not if all events existed in the same moment, and I felt freed. I felt unburdened by the need to manifest a particular outcome into being. And then he's going to forget all of this once we reset. To exist I suppose that is timeline. the saving and grace of this is was he is totally suffering right now. Of my being. It was and then he'll forget about it. The spaciousness, the equanimity of the moment, both singular and infinite. For the longest time, this was my experience. I'm not enjoying the sandwich. I'm just going to tear the chicken off and, and eat that. Unyielding fear Don't look I at me, I'm a gremlin. Known, crept into my mind. And it is this sensation that I have been experiencing now for longer than I could have Aww. ever expected was possible. I have been waiting for you. Not <gasps> that you might save me or do something to fix it, but merely to stay Thank you, Pastor. for you. The plain fact of this manner of existence. Aww. I wish you to feel afraid as I do. That perhaps one day this state of mind will consume you as well. Perhaps you will somehow, in some way, have to live as I do now. And I wish for you to know how excruciating it is, and for you to be in true terror Why would you of wish its that upon me, sir? Arrival. If I can only do this, only this one thing, perhaps it will bring me the smallest moment. Why do you want me to suffer too? In the darkness. Hello? How? Is that what he's trying to do right now? He's like, yeah. See, it's the silence. The warm cardboard sandwich has been consumed. Technically. I'm gonna do a look-see around the room if nothing's changed, and then I'm gonna press a no button. Huzzah! Onward! Aw, I hope he didn't die. I mean, I don't think he can die. Everything's still the same? Sorry? Hello? Oh, the fan finally is getting bad. I was wondering how long it take. Oh. The fire alarm, uh, or like, I 
What? Oh, is that like a... I can only press it within a certain time? Not fire alarm, but just like battery change. Or CO2, I'm gonna slowly die. And then we'll reset! Dude, straight up, I'm surprised he hasn't reset it yet. But they didn't understand the game was never meant to be funny. It was meant to have a point. It was meant to speak He's to the still, human condition. Uh, Where are the jokes? Where are the been jokes? Here. They bemoaned. They screamed. Sure. They gnashed their teeth and said, entertain us. It wasn't enough. They had to leave a pathetic little thumbs down review <laughs> and make all Aww, of their pitiful buddy. demands. But then he's talking too much. They said first he didn't entertain us. Now he won't shut up. It's the inconsistency. But it's the lack of accountability. I liked it's the, the entertaining guy. I liked with a that he didn't shut up. Compromising heart. The words that they are speaking into the world. Can take some as water. Though there were no consequences for a lack of cohesion in one's assessment of others. But of course, remember to stay hydrated, anyone gamers. Anyone can leave a review. So here's what we get. We get these demands that seek everything and are accountable to nothing. We get a world where someone will say, oh, there should be a skip button. You should be able to freeze Stanley in place while the narrator Aww, sits there forever and ever. We want all of this in the new Stanley parable. We demand it. And then, because it was said, because it was spoken, now it simply has to happen. The most immediate desires. Aww, every single thing demanded by every person at every moment in time. If someone wants it, then it's a crime not to bring it into being. Have we been given to indulging every fleeting whim for no reason other than to do so? Yes! Yes! It seems that this is now the world we live in. It seems that we are Aww. a people living in such bleakness and discomfort with ourselves that our entertainment is now our lives. It has come to represent us. It absolutely must speak to who we are as people. Because otherwise, without our entertainment, we have nothing. Without entertainment, we would have to face inward so toward this the new cruel content, huh? bleakness inside ourselves. We would turn to look at our deeper nature and find a resounding emptiness gazing back with unyielding aggression. And so, so because of I this, know, I think we I'm require pretty cool. that our amusements yeah, and our it's playthings way and too our real for me. Fancy be so Welcome to the stream, Deathqua. They consume all of Happy our attention. Happy Friday. Turn our heads completely away I from the bleakness. I feel so bad for In this effect, man. We have demanded he's over that here. our entertainment be the collapse of uh, ourselves. Suffering while I get to skip what through a things. What a reflection of humanity these entertainments are. What a shameful mirror to the human <laughs> oh, spirit. Average. I'm not mad. I'm not mad about any of this. Aww, I'm at peace he's with still it. in I denial. Am the calm of Poor guy. Around which these perversions hurl themselves. I am a As a creator, I relate. God, I get that. Disorder. They're the ones me who doing are my mad. art like. They're the ones who couldn't Ooh. stand the idea of me using my game to try to say something. Maybe. What kind of create do you create, gamer? Yes. yes, of course. They've been jealous of me this whole time. I mean, they are mired in fear and insecurity. Okay. They cannot help but attempt to tear me down. Interesting what a take. Sad state of affairs. When you read these reviews now, you can see it. You can taste the bitter resentment. And my, how good does it feel now to speak truth to these words? To finally allow these does thoughts. Does it feel like bitter resentment? It just feels so long, like neutered and sterilized. At last, I am free to truly honestly. think, to feel. It must be Ooh, they were an so indie dev. With themselves. They couldn't Godspeed, gamer. It's a lot of work, regardless of what kind of like game you're indieing. That shit can be so me. difficult. Perhaps the state of their psychological me being 13, opening up moral wins, a uh, creation club kit so thing, and I was like, ooh, how do you make a level? And even like basic level, like put stuff together, like. This you it can, see. can be so it's difficult, and like, don't even get me started on making a game from the ground up. That it be filled with yucks Ooh. and whimsical humor, that it amuse them so, endlessly like, from start. Hopefully to that's point. going well. Hopefully you're having a fun time with it. Game was never hopefully you're not to be feeling funny, too burnt out. To point. With a lot it of my like art projects, human burnout is so. Okay, he's screen. repeating himself. Burnout is such a big thing for me, and that can really make me lose faith in a project. Oh no, he's stopped being. Aww. Yeah, it do be real. Oh. oh, the button reset. Okay. So we just gotta take things slow. We gotta take our breaks where we can. And it's okay if we hop around from project to project. Something Sometimes you need something to, like, spice up your, your creative juices, you know? 
the end is never the end is never the end oh, is never the poor end guy. is never the end is never the end is never the end is never the end is never the But you remember this this is from this is from the hit uh video game the Stanley Parable the end is never the end is never the end Oh poor guy is never the end is never the end No yeah I get that like I was talking to somebody about like this art piece that I put out the other day and I was like oh the end is Wait no no please no, please. No. Man, I can't believe the narrator from hit game Stanley Parable just died. Am I gonna drown in here? Is that how I'm going to find an exit? I'm gonna go up to the top and I can finally leave? Huh. Oh shit, I love Portal! Let's get out of here! Wait, is the button? Okay, sorry, I was wondering if it was broken. Hi Major, happy Friday! Welcome to uh, Pain and Suffering with my good friend Stanley. I'm gonna go up there. No! I just wanted to play his game! He wouldn't let me! He wasn't happy with his game. And now he isn't anything. <sighs> Rip narrator, you will be missed. Do I just gotta wait for things to come back down? Okay. Can I go yet? I wanna go. I like the music. No! I couldn't escape. I wanted my happy ending. Doing some schoolwork. Ooh, hopefully that goes well. Oh no! What happened with Wednesday's stream? Was it like bitrate stuff? Cause I was dealing with that earlier today and it's suffering because out of all the things I can't control, I wanna go. Bitrate is one of them. Oh, yeah, let's go. Oh, uh, can I? Internet died, aw, and no one was able to stop by, aw. Wow, I'm surprised this was the one building that survived. Can I not go? Uh, anything behind here? That sucks, dude, though. I'm sorry to hear that. That's the difficult thing about streams is, like, sometimes you're playing to an audience, other times you're just playing to yourself. Let me go up on the building. We'll just go towards the horizon. No, let me double check the button real quick. I don't wanna. Ah! Oof. He will never know the suffering he went through, but he was trapped in that moment, which, uh, sucks. Even now, Stanley's office was a distant memory. <laughs> yeah. What did it look like? There was a computer, perhaps, and a painting. Was it a painting or a photo? What's with that noise? He could no longer recall. Hello? No matter how hard Stanley looked, he couldn't find a trace of his co-workers. Is something going on outside? Is it like the apocalypse part two? Can I put input on a computer? Username access, I remember that. I mean, uh, it is how it goes. Fingers crossed for the better. I've got a going away party that I'm going to for some friends of mine, so I may not be able to make it, but I really hope it goes well. What are you thinking oh, about good. swimming? You notice my sign. Oh, yes, I have something. It's his new content. Aw, let's go. Are we going this way this time? That way? Uh, this way? This way? 
This way? Oh, okay. He's gonna give me new content? That's so sweet! He's gonna give me DLC. Ooh! Tarkov! Get that good, good... Huh, weird. Get that good, good gun! Who's in there? You see, Stanley, I've been reflecting on the Stanley Parable and about how roundly disappointing this ultra-deluxe version has turned out to be. The original Stanley Parable was a landmark, and any new content for it should live up to that legacy. So forget this ultra-deluxe nonsense. No, buddy, but nonsense. it's difficult to live up to legacy. One step even further. Sorry? Which is why I'm very proud to announce for the first time ever the Stanley Parable 2. No! I just had this conversation. This conversation about Overwatch 2, please. Uh, okay, interesting. Yes, you see, isn't this far superior to a measly he doesn't re get it. with a few minor additions? Yeah, he's still trash in the jump circle. The territory will come Unless with a fully fledged sequel. The Stanley Parable 2 has the jump circle. From the ground up. I can't Why are jump. So many possibilities. It could go mm -hmm. in so many different directions. I will say this is what I do appreciate how everything was designed. For. Like the simplicity really calls back to like it being an office. Uh the black and white with the harsh red, like I know it's simple and like a lot of people could do it but like it's good and like how there are things that are like red amongst the black and white that's it's good listen it's good i appreciate Calling that it the stanley parable too is just so much catchier than ultra deluxe don't you think ultra deluxe what does it even mean okay but i the like stanley parable this too now that's an artistic statement right there it would mean more if they had like origin. clutter in the it corners or something progress and innovation and long-term <laughs> franchise give me impotent. give me the sequel i want a sippy oh. oops photos off painting dot tga what the heck is a dot tga the ganley arable Honestly, they could have just left the desktop image up and it would have been fine. Off painting. Hello? Oh, I love that song! Real talk? I don't even know what a TGA file is. So maybe they do? Or maybe that was part of the joke where they named it .tga because they were like, <laughs> it's a joke. No! It's a new mug. They got rid of Coffee Nut. Okay. So maybe they do exist then. Two doors. Oh, what? Oh. New hotness. Ooh. Okay. It's from 2000. Oh my god. That makes me feel like a like a baby. All file extensions exist? Surely not all of them. Color red. I like that. Logo ideas. Ah, you didn't do the the comic stands. Thanks for attending my meeting. I like the second to bottom one, but only because it makes me laugh about the Resident Evil uh, games. Wait, are these all meant to be like parodies or something? Because I don't recognize anything else. Okay, moving on. Oh, the fern! Yeah, yeah, I recognize it. Thank you, Paste. It's not just me. I like that. That's a bit weird. Now, to be oh, clear, sorry? I haven't quite nailed down what exactly the Stanley Parable 2 is going to be. But you did but the marketing stuff already? The features I've been developing for it. I figure that if I can loosely organize <laughs> a me. handful of interesting concepts, that surely the game will sort of Goose naturally scrum. spring up around them. It'll all work itself out. Game development is much more of a fuzzy magic than anything scientific or logical, really. One of those logos looked like The Last of Us 2? Oh, maybe. I could see that, I say, having never played. Uh, 
I really like how they added Aladdin to Return of Jafar. Like, that means a lot to me. And I also like how Portal 2 was above Half-Life 2, I say, being a baby who has only played Portal 2. Crab! The ultimate sequel. There is only one step, and it is Crab. Testing two printers at the same time. Two, two, two. They're going a little bit overboard. I am the sequel. Aw, thank you. Valued investors. Oh no, he's selling out. Man, how are you doing that? That's pretty cool. Ooh. All of this, but they don't even know what the game Try out some of the new features. It's going to be. The button that says the name of the player that is playing the game. Oh, yeah? Yeah? I call that bullshit. Unless he says Stanley. For the Stanley this is Parable such a big-ass room. I asked myself, what do players really want? And of course, the first and most obvious answer is that they want to be individually recognized. I mean, he's definitely as correct. As I like so being mind, recognized. My first addition to the game is this button, which speaks the name of the person playing the game. Isn't that wonderful? But does it work? Jim. Sorry, I should have clarified. Right now, yeah, okay. the button only says the name Jim. But of course, in the final game, this button will say your name, whatever name that is. Here. Imagine being a Jim really and playing this game and being like, what Just the fuck? I promise you'll love it. Mind blown. Okay, here we go. Let's I'm take a Jim. deep breath, clear your mind, forget whoever you are, and simply become a person named Jim. Okay. I want you to imagine yourself living as Jim, sleeping and waking as Jim, falling in love and being heartbroken as Jim. Jim would just like lose his shit, and then as the narrator as keeps talking, he's Jim, like, "Watching your dreams crumble Aww. into dust." Imagine being someone named Jim. Deeply, uh, could be me. Jim, right now. Jim, Jim, so, Jim, then Jim, step Jim. Step forward and press the button. Jim. <gasps> Holy shit! Yes, oh, that's so cool! See, what a thrill! What a rush! That was you! The button described because you! Because I'm Do not again. Stanley. I'm Jim. Okay, come on. Jim. Okay, I like it. It's even harder the second I wish time. it would have been if the narrator's the voice, but this is nice. I like Stanley it. Parable too, it would still be worth the money. <laughs> would it be? Let's take a break from okay, the Jim yeah, yeah. I'm too emotionally drained from all of this personal value. No, yeah, I need to stop the thrill that is going through my veins right now from hearing the game say my name. I mean, Jim is funnier. I, I I can get that. But also, I'm over here like, man, remember how back in 2009, the sickest name was Bob? Bob would just make me lose my shit in school. I, I suppose I could what? allow Sorry? any people named Jim to play the standard. Yeah, but at what cost? Too. That would actually save me the work of finishing this feature. You gotta finish the feature or just get rid of it. <laughs> Woo. Hello. Wait. An epilogue would be fun, wouldn't it, Stanley? Yes. Oh. Yes, it will go at the end of the um uh, well, we'll At the end of what? Later. Is that me? Is that that's me? That's Stanley? Man, I love this new content. I feel like I'm being Oh, yeah, hell yeah. Yes, please. Is it... Why does this look like a Nancy Drew character? Oh god. Like, his face is kind of okay, but his hand and his elbows, I'm just like, oh god. Is this meant to be Stanley? Nah, Stanley looks different. I'm not, he is not my canon Stanley. My Canley. Yeah, hell yeah. 
Now, here's something special. You remember that broken test achievement that got left in the game on accident? Mm -hmm. Well, I'm developing a technology to simply give you the achievement. <gasps> Yay! Yes. You see, you'll come to this lever, and when you pull it, the achievement will be given to you. It's as simple as that. I mean, I guess we'll see if it works, right? Okay, perhaps I should have clarified. Ugh. This is technology that will exist. I right wanted now, that the free achievement, achievement. Is still fully broken. I'm not a wizard, Stanley, but I guarantee it will be fixed no! in the sequel. To at last satisfy <laughs> the hordes of ravenous fans all over the world who have been uproariously demanding this feature. Gamers, we hear you. I'm a gamer. And I promise it will happen. That's me. I'm trying to pull. I want it. Oh, okay. Do we go back then? Okay. <laughs> Oops, sorry. Oh, hello. Ah, uh, it's just a dead end. Something, something critique on releasing features that well, either don't work other exhibits have or are that? unnecessary. <gasps> Oh. You know what? Let's bring the jump circle Please. back for Stanley oh, no. Idol 2 as well. It's a... Oh, wait. You already spent all your jumps the first time yeah, we saw on. the jump circle. Hmm. Oh, well. I suppose it can just be a nice decorative No jumps piece, remaining. Then. Player tears. Ah, It's still the crispy zero. I'm so sad, man. I was so excited. Also, I guess he did like that content then. Where am I? Do I do the button that says the name? Okay, merch. Should I go look at the merch? Is that the collectibles? Or jump circle exit, collectibles exit. Uh, where's the merch? Oh yeah, okay, let's play some portal, let's go. No screenshots? Oh, yeah, okay. Oh, I get it, because it's like no pictures. Okay, I'll be honest, I haven't yet Ooh. decided on this one. I think that in the new version, the office could use a bit of decoration, like balloons. But I'm undecided on Get Well Someday and Happy 12th Birthday. Which would you go with? I would go with uh, Get Well Someday, because... Legally, I'm 11. <gasps> no, but then it could be my 12th birthday. They're celebrating me. Oh. Ah, oh, but I'm not a step niece. Okay, get well someday. You know, sometimes when you solicit another person's opinion, it makes you realize that you knew which <sighs> one you actually really wanted all along. Happy 12th birthday, step niece it is. If I chose the other one... Or actually, maybe I should have gone with... No. No, sure? I've made my decision. We're moving on. Come now. Uh -oh. You've already made your choice. It's oh, clear on. that you chose badly. Hey! But we all have to move on from our mistakes. Don't gotta be rude about it. <laughs> oh, there's the merch. Oh, dead ass. I would wear that. I would wear that. I really like that. Maybe without the uh, Stanley Parable 2, maybe they could make that small and like on the back or like near the neck or something or on the sleeve, but I would wear that. What? I, I can't scan QR codes. Can anybody scan that? I don't have a QR code reader because I don't use QR codes. Uh, gamer. Let me take a sip of coffee real quick. Please, somebody, anybody. Real quick, just in case, this is, this is where the QR code goes to. I'm going to look up Stanley Parable 2 merch. Red bubble, Stanley Parable. Oh, I'm not seeing anything. Oh, it takes you to the Stanley Parable website. Well, joke's on them. I just got there. So, <laughs> got him. StanleyParable2.com. StanleyParable2.com Taste the sequel. Learn more. A sequel, huh? Okay. Direct YouTube link. Thanks for stopping by. If you like this, privacy policy. 
crows 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 dot com crows 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 are they the ones that made this game should watch the video it's pretty funny uh let me am i able to hold up maybe i can do this real quick no split two done what if I did this real quick? Eh? No! Get back there! I'll fix that guy later. Display capture. Do you guys want to watch a, a, vi a video real quick? See there, Timmy. What's that you're enjoying? Why? It's breakfast, of course. Everyone loves breakfast. But did you know that breakfast is getting a sequel? That's right. Oh my god. It's called Lunch. And <gasps> critics are raving that lunch will be everything breakfast was and more. With a little luck, we may even get a trilogy series out of it. Say, you know Talking what a sequel dinner? is, don't you, Timmy? Why, sequels are the world's way of clinging helplessly to the past. We all want more of the things we love, and we're all afraid of change, which is what makes sequels so popular. New ideas are dangerous, Timmy, and they can lead to early aging. This oh, eager-minded no. young thinker is just 29 years old. That's why we have sequels, to keep us couched in the familiar and the comfortable. Sequels are the bedrock of a healthy, functional society. And if you look around you, you'll find them everywhere you go. For instance, this man is developing a sequel to the automobile, which we'll call the vertical automobile. It's a useless, impractical invention. The and in two days' time, automobile? the man will be publicly stoned to death for his crimes against gravity. Not all sequels are heretical nonsense, however. Here's the man who invented breathing, which is the <laughs> sequel to suffocating and dying a slow death. Even your parents are getting a sequel, Timmy. Their names are Rob and Jessica, and they'll be taking care of you once your original parents are sent back in time to fight a secret war for the government. Sequels can what? be very fashionable. This young woman is wearing five shirts at once, which is the sequel to wearing four shirts at once. Look at Becky over there, wearing only two shirts at once. Get with the times, Oh, no, poor Becky. In fact, there is only one single thing in the world that isn't a sequel. It's this. We don't know what it is or why it exists, but it's the prequel from Yo, which but that all is sequels cool. are derived. And just like everything else, the Stanley Parable is getting a sequel too. We all know, of course, that it was your favorite game as a child. Don't you remember those long, lazy afternoons you it spent did playing come out the when Stanley I was in Parable? School, so. Watching your precious youth fritter away hour after hour. We've all wasted our childhoods in one way or another, and you were fortunate enough to get to waste yours on the Stanley Parable. But the Stanley Parable came out years ago, and you're not a child anymore. You're a man. Which is like the sequel to a child. Oh no! And as a man, you want manly things like taxes and cheating at baseball. You need a man's video game, Timmy. And that's why the Timmy. Stanley Parable Two will be perfect for Why does this look me. like that animator who does like video a summary of? And if you don't it's gotta be that animator, me, right? Let's look at the burly hunk of a man who's it's responsible It's gotta be like that has game. that vibe. Huh. Here he is, hard at work. His I name am. is Gregory Eightpack. I'm 12 and he's year the cutting and picture I'm 60 and I'm a man and I'm a cat girl. Gregory like is what we call the ideas guy, and he has the most important role on the team. The ideas guy tirelessly comes up with interesting concepts and then hands them off to the rest of the developers for the relatively simple job of turning those concepts into reality. For example, he's the one who picked up the phone and declared, Someone ought to make a sequel to the Stanley Parable. <laughs> Good work, Let me Gregory. Just double check real quick. Go ahead and take the rest of this the video. This video's nine minutes With long. Part out of the uh, do you guys want to watch the whole thing? Because we can. The game's developers must answer a simple question. I just what unsure. What makes a sequel in the first place? Well, it's simple. Sequels are an opportunity to correct the mistakes of their predecessors. We've all made mistakes, and we've all caused harm to someone we love hmm. in order to cover up our mistakes. When developing this particular sequel, it's important to start by thinking, what mistakes did the original Stanley Parable make? Well, first I'm interested off, in seeing most all of the, the vibes, pornography in the original but game I do want to play the game. But we can always play the game in the future. And it's time we paid the licensing fees fair and square. Second, 
The Stanley parable was catastrophic for this man named Leroy, whose personal information, including home address, social security number, and bank information, were all displayed prominently in multiple locations throughout the game. Holy shit! Although Leroy's Leroy. mother and identity were stolen, the fact remains that his personal information was the emotional core of the game, and absolutely what vital to young a boys in the 50s understanding and striped of the story. Shirts. As reparation for the harm it caused him, the sequel will contain a brief and insincere apology to Leroy, tucked deep within the game, where it will be difficult to find. I'm gonna keep Finally, an eye out for an apology for Leroy. Made the mistake yeah. of leaking too Hi, many government secrets about the nature of the time wars. Without oh, these yeah, intricate okay. details they of haven't specific had military color, so they had tactics, to like, okay. the story is likely to make very little saying, sense, Pastor. but we've decided to remove them from the so sequel in then. the interest of helping the state's efforts. We'll get to you yet, Time Dracula. <laughs> now then, time Dracula? it's time to set oh, about God. constructing the Stanley Parable 2. Game development is a difficult and complex art, one which can only be fully understood by this race of hyper-intelligent child soldiers bred in laboratories. Uh -oh. They begin by studying the original Stanley Parable. Here it is in its raw, untouched form, <laughs> a specimen of so technological that's what a video perfection. Game looks like. Time to exploit it for profit. We begin by adding jokes. The Stanley Parable oh, is most math. widely known for its stark lack of humor, bucking all conventional industry wisdom. It was a bold artist <laughs> statement that its development stood firmly Death behind. You can confirm Deathwalk. That that is but a video game. That's actually what it's you impossible have. To uh, you're working on one right now. Consumer of video games without jokes of some kind. So very well, jokes it'll be. Why does he look During like a fuckboy? He's just like over 500 <laughs> kiloliters of comedy <laughs> will be funneled directly into the core of the Stanley Parable too. Creating jobs for hundreds of machine operators and producing 30,000 tons of pollutant chemical byproduct, oh which will be pumped directly into local lakes, rivers, and beautiful Stanley nature Parable reserves like these no. all over the country. Don't pollute the ocean. Another common complaint of the Stanley <gasps> Parable is that there wasn't enough gameplay. And oh, so for the sequel, so gameplay, its developers have gone to great lengths to fix this problem. Here we can see gameplay being printed on the sheets. Every video game contains as many as a thousand oh, wow. sheets of gameplay. I don't know how you're going to be able to like make so many uh, sheets of gameplay, dude. Because that looks like a very devices, serious the process. The gameplay sheets have to be printed smaller. For the Stanley Parable 2, as many as 35 really makes you respect, new gameplay like, sheets have been printed. The indie developers who are just like a one-man team, or even like a five-man team, because this is a lot of work for them. Because this is a lot of work for them. Added into the game. This man is Respect stealing your game gameplay sheets gamers. from the factory, which he likely intends to use Most for a time. personal project he's been developing in his spare time. A good public stoning will cure him of that inclination. Uh -huh. Let's check on Gregory real quick. Ha! Still recovering from a hard day's work. Don't you move a muscle. Next up, God, it's it time me. to blackmail the press. <laughs> in a competitive market, Blackmailing your local journalist can be one of the most effective methods of creating word-of-mouth buzz for your sequel. In fact, blackmail is the currency of social progress. From your neighborhood grocer to the teacher at your school to the man who helps you steal wow, that's HBO, a lot of work, everyone man. responds to blackmail. Like, and if you've never done gamer. it before, it's easy to practice at home on your friends and no family. No wonder people get burnt out Simply so quickly. follow the instructional pamphlet and, that your teacher ah, hands out after the end know. of the film. I and never finally, about there's that. one last tool at our disposal for making the sequel we'll feel fresh Maybe and should, exciting. Uh, and that's nail, packaging uh, the game with collector's edition merchandise. If you order the Stanley Parable 2, you'll receive this cow's <gasps> egg. I a want single a cow egg, egg will produce over a thousand cows, which are, of course, the sequel to pigs. And there you have it. Everything there is to know about producing the Stanley Parable 2. Of course, you may know that there is also a game titled The Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe. So which game is the true sequel to The Stanley Parable? It's an excellent question, Billy. One which the child soldiers have been working oh round God. the clock I to come up with an answer soldiers. to. And after many weeks of diligent research, the conclusion they've reached is, who gives a shit? <laughs> All that matters is that it's more that content for you to cram down your insatiable server stream. You don't want thoughtful and nuanced answers to complex questions, Billy. You just want to eat bubble gum and cheat at hopscotch. So get out there and I consume. Eat Do your gum. civic duty and bully your parents hopscotch. into buying you every version of the Stanley Parable 2 on every childhood. platform. Tell your friends to bully their parents as well. 
It's through community efforts like these that the world comes together in harmony and connection. And it's only through this connection that we'll defeat Time Dracula we once and for all. We need a skip button. All. Don't let I mean, I don't know about skip, but I know there's a pause win. button. Buy the Stanley Parable Unless too, it's almost and over. Pledge to support yeah, it's almost sequels. over. That was nine today, minutes, gamers. Tomorrow, and into the great unknowable beyond. Yay! <laughs> oh my god. That's the... Ah! What are all these? Wah! Okay, let's go ahead and... And let's fix this real quick because I made things a little bit wonky. We're just gonna take this and go... Hup, 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 but, but yeah, close enough. Billy, you will be missed. A lot of them were lo-fi, and one of them was, like, some bullshit. I don't know why. There was at least one butt, and I never watch videos about butts, so I'm a bit confused. Eh. Okay, I'm back at it again. Uh, bucket. Wait. Infinite hole? Ah, niece's birthday. I don't know why. I don't even know what the video was. I saw it and but I was like, ugh, it's a butt. Stanley Parable was that it was confusing and paradoxical. Just pick it up. That it engendered a chaotic I mean, sense of I like butt. Despair I like Tibby. Well, I like Kick. I'm happy to say that after much consideration, I've engineered a clever solution to this fundamental problem with the game. Yeah? It's, it's the Stanley Parable reassurance bucket. Ooh. You see, Stanley, anytime you're holding the bucket, a sense of calm and ease will fill your mind and your heart. It's true. As long as you hold onto the bucket, the many disorienting contradictions of the Stanley parable will feel perfectly normal. I would and like that. Even comforting. Can you I have it? You even come to long for the gentle embrace of jarring cognitive dissonance while the bucket is in your arms. And to be honest, it's a much more convenient solution for me than actually redesigning the game to be less uncomfortable. No, I like that the game is uncomfortable. Pain in the ass that would be. Yes, <laughs> the bucket he is said the ace. perfect solution. Come on, give it a try. Okay. <laughs> Sorry? Can you feel it? The glow of comfort. Was that the bucket the or you? Of crushing despair must already be sweeping through your body. And in fact, can I say that I do believe the bucket lends oh, you an why, air thank of you. as well? I think that just holding Narrator, it has made thank you the slightest you. bit more attractive as a person. <gasps> the so sweet to me. On and on, I think you're just flattering me, though. More await you in the Stanley Parable too. It's a shiny ass bucket, that's for sure. Do, you, do I need to put it back, or? Okay, this is mine. Two. Do I just get this? Does anyone give out awards for most enjoyable bucket in a video game? That really should be an award if it isn't already. The button that says Jim. Oh, uh, did they change it? Like the button that says your name. Uh, that's you. Oh God. What's over here? Ooh, I like the carpet. No, but I like the orange. Red is too YouTube y. The new updated Ray Trace and more of the same, but in a good way. Sequel to the. Okay. Schween shaders. Like, my Schween? Hello? I'm surprised they don't have any music. I'm gonna get away from that then. I need to do the infinite hole. Is it you? No Schween, but I want the Schween! Oh, ooh! Ah, collectibles. Oh, this is collectibles. Now it's a real video game. In the Stanley Parable 2, you'll run around gathering up these miniature Stanley figurines. And what's truly innovative 
is that there will be no reward oh. for collecting all of them. Oof. I don't want to stifle the intrinsic joy of watching a number go up. Oh, look you at all these collect all of them, collectibles. And then you move the hell on with your unremarkable life. This is, uh, kind of solid. Oh, this is artsy. I do kind of like it. It's silly as hell, but I like it. Give me. We did it! Stanley looks pathetic. Aw, oh, man. Can I just keep going, or...? Nope, I'm just in the dark. Oof. Where's the infinite hole? God, it really does the worst when you collect everything in a video game, and then they give you a big fancy reward for it. Absolutely tragic. I like tragic. rewards. Okay, so if I'm here, the infinite hole is down that way. Ah, okay. We got a little figurine! A silly little figurine of Stan Wee. Yeah, okay. Okay. Uh, will I be able to come back up, or...? Oof. Goofy. Stanley, here's an idea that I'm truly fond of. It's never been done before in a video game. This is, in fact, a hole that you can fall down forever. It's never been done before. Infinite falling. You can fall until the end of time. Oh man, I thought I could go there. Stunning leap forward for video games as a medium. But I, what if I don't want to fall forever? How will I get out? I mean, uh, I suppose it's an ending, right? Do you want my bucket? Uh, yeah. You see, what? isn't it wonderful? One of my more ingenious concoctions, if I do say so. Now then, since you've gotten to see the infinite hole, you can press the teleport button to pop back up to the top, and we can continue onward. Oh, I'm glad there's a... This feels like some SCP hmm. shit. Now, I don't mean to be a bummer, but I do recommend you use the teleport button to go back to the top. Maybe do it on the sooner rather than Why? later spectrum of things. Why? Okay, Stanley. I don't know quite how to say this tactfully, but it's possible that I slightly oh, yeah, yeah. exaggerated the infinite nature of the hole. Is it a very, very deep hole? To be certain, it I is. want that to disappear. It's an extremely deep. Hole. I don't know what's at the bottom. I don't want anyone to say that. But it if I find out, I will probably also have is. my is leg bones infinite? go through my brain bone. Well, that sort of depends on your definition of. I infinity. want the hole to disappear. From one perspective. The infinite is merely oh God. philosophical in nature. Oh God. It's more of a... Okay, well, uh, good for oh you. Oh no! You People awesome littered down hole. here. You found me out, Stanley. I'm a liar and a cheat, and you're so clever. I didn't... Look, I think you're not a liar and a cheat. You're just silly. You're unusually fascinated by I'm glad I didn't die. What normal I'm at the bottom. Wants to fall infinitely. I just wanted the hole to disappear. I was as deep as anyone would actually need. Don't you put this on me. Maybe oh, you're yeah. the problem. You're getting defensive, dude. <sighs> Look, uh, the things got a little heated there. I think we both said some things we didn't mean. Get a load of this guy. Just put all 30 this minutes left on stream. To just call the hole mostly infinite. But then it's if not infinite. For you, then go ahead and press the teleport button to warp up to the top of the hole and we can move on. I'll just be up here when you're ready. Up here? Okay, bye. Oops. Great, now. I'm very excited to show you. Oh, for heaven! <laughs> you see, I was right. The problem is you. I'm sorry. The problem is that you like holes too much. I just wanted much. to. A normal, a normal person. I'm Should sorry. Have that's an infinite hole right there goes on forever till the end of time. Don't need to see it all, but not you. Oh no, 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 no! You have a weird sort of. Not oh. that weird. Did the hole seem even shorter to you this time? Yeah, it I couldn't did. help but feel like you spent a little less yeah, the, the, time the, the, in it's bigger. Than before. I mean, admittedly, I didn't make I hope I'm not like ruining thing. his game. I didn't think it was that not infinite. Well, I suppose once again there's nothing to do. So what here. you're telling you me is I'm enough of the hole, you can hit the teleport button. I'm here to help to him debug the game. Point. I'm here to say, "Hey, 
here's a potential bug. Had enough? I'm positive. We need to work through this until it's fixed. Gosh, how could I have guessed? You're back in the hole. If this starts to become a thing we're Wow. Okay. I'm just checking. Yes. I'm starting to become extremely certain that the hole is not only not infinite, but that it's growing steadily less and less infinite. I suspect that I'm starting to hit the point where it's no longer feasible to call Oops. the hole infinitely deep, even by the lax overall standards for accountability and marketing. What's going on here? Stanley, I have no explanation for the uncertain nature of the hole's length. Here, let's try something. Mm -hmm. Let's pop back up to the top and we'll see if it gets any shorter. Now you're speaking my language. Well, there it is. Oh. The shame of my lie has come to haunt me. Not only is the hole not infinite, but it's barely it's like a, a hole pit. at this point. It's more of a concavity, or even a very aggressive divot. Ooh. How is this still appealing to you? I know you're obsessed I just with holes, to... but at this depth, I just can't see this scratching the It's itch. not about the hole. Oh, who am I to judge? You just do whatever it is you're here to do and hit the teleport button when you're ready to move on. Surface. Surface. Hmm. Oh, God. It's because I'm at the surface. The, um, do I need a crouch? Teleport button not working. Does this count? You sure? Yeah. Well, I mean, I really don't have an explanation. Oh. Still nothing. Well, I suppose. I, I suppose there is one thing I can do. Wait, no, don't do it. I'm out. Goodbye, Stanley. You couldn't bear to be away what? from the oh, hole. Oh, that's nothing. Now you'll get I can't. I'm out of jumps. It is a circle, it's a though. Win for everyone. But you I get am... to be with the hole. I get to do literally anything <laughs> else. Take care, Stanley. But I've got the bucket. I hope you the have a wonderful rest of eternity. What? You should have debugged things better. Whoop. Is huh. Oh god. <gasps> I get it. The hole was just shy. It didn't want to be seen by the narrator. anymore. Oh, but I have the bucket. That's cute. Oh, yeah. I love Danganronpa. Just going down the elevator, waiting for the trial. Oh, my God. Is that actually Stanley? Buddy, no. That feels like... you expect it's the Stanley parable an existential comedy as swaggy put it so well oh god I'm digging into the earth puppy Sorry, I'm just like looking for one that I like. Using up the space of mine. My head stronger. You're no longer using 
Yeah, okay, this is a vibe. Oh shit. Weird. Whoops. I didn't mean to press them all at the same time. Let's keep the space one, I guess. Oh god. Oh, that's me! Stanley? Stanley? What's up? Stanley. Sorry? Oh good, you're awake. It seems you had sort of dozed off there. I was having Did a good time there. But we can't have that, Stanley. Because this hole is just so darn fascinating that I want you to be wide awake for every second of it. You don't want to miss a single moment. So how about if I just pop in from time to time and wake you up to keep you really... That's what fever dreams are made of, God, hole. honestly. From the looks of things, you and I will have many, many years here in this oh, hole. God. And I'm looking forward to all of them. Stay alert, Stanley. I'll be back. Toodle pip. Take me back. Please. I don't know what else to do. Please. Let me change my reality. Ah. Oh. Wait, no! But the new content! I didn't get to exit. Oh. That's odd. Here we are. Go on. Try out some of the new features. I'm just trying to figure out where the exit is now. I do also like how it's now the mostly infinite hole. Exit? Settings, world champion. Okay, if I'm here, then it should be... Okay, if that's the free achievement, then that means what I need to do is I need to go in here. Wait, no, in... Here? No. Just double checking. Okay, so it should be in that little area. I want to know all the new content. The only content. Wait a second. Where's the other one then? Where's the settings? Is it up top? There's an up top? No. Settings were- oh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think this might be the last thing. What the? Is there a setting where I can open it? Ugh, why would I reset my settings? I'm so happy. Nice. Content warnings is nice. Audio, video. I'm not the world champion. I don't know why. Can I just turn that on? Uh. Boo. Fine, then I guess I'll just leave. You can't be the world champion. Okay, let's just go through here real quick. Because I think I'll just head to the exit because we're good to go. What a wonderful presentation. Uh, thank you for that. Where's the exit? Did I go the wrong way? I think I might want the wrong way. Check my achievements. Wah! Uh, welcome back. Commitment. Click on door 435 times. Speed runs. Set all the setting sliders in the menu to all the available numbers. That sounds like hell. So let's that, let's remember it's seventy two. Hopefully, 
hopefully I don't need to like save each a number because that would be hell. Setting speed run. Whoa, 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 whoa. So this is how you play. This is, ah, this is how you play. Stanley Parable. I know I can drag, but I don't know if it's like, I don't know if that counts, you know? The Ignoring you. Don't touch me. Well, I guess I didn't do it right. Did I miss anything? Thought, I guess not. Eh. I can become a champion later. I thought I did it right, but... Maybe it's because I didn't set it? Where's the exit? No, but I want to become... Let me double check it again. Just want to double check. Set all the setting sliders in the menu to all the available numbers. Is there more numbers? What do you mean I skipped so many settings? Some sliders hidden in other options? Oh god. Oh. Not yet. You have to turn some on to see them. That's whack. Did I miss some? I already did that. It'll tell me when I exit. We shall see then, I guess. Cries. Did I do it? Please? Hello? Hello? I just want to be a Statics World Champion. I guess let's go loiter over there and then I'll try again. I gotta go up top. Right. I'm a fool. How is my settings? That's new. How is my settings speed run? Am I okay? No! I must have missed some. Let me check out what's in here real quick. Because that looks new. Nah, this is not new. You lied to me. I must have missed some then. Just double checking once more. We have a man. Shush. Can't believe I'm playing with settings. Simply. 
That must be it. But if it doesn't do anything now, then I'll probably just exit. That's a shame. It would be very nice, but... <sighs> Better luck next time, gamers. Let's get on out of here. I'm not the Cedric's world champion. Oh, are those the office buildings and such? Oh no, those are shelves. Okay. All right. Have you seen everything you wanted to? No. Ready to move on now? I haven't. But you're being a stinker. I don't know what the vibe is. I don't know what the vibe is. Like, hypothetically, I did play with everything. But I guess there's nothing else I could do. I gotta go. I'm just, I need to move on. That's a little horrifying. Infinite hole? So, Stanley, what do you think? Do you like all of the new features? No. Yes, I know it's not exactly clear yet how exactly these features will come together as one single coherent video game, but I can feel it in my soul. It's going to work. That's not how There's the games work, dude. There's a good game in there somewhere. Say, let's do an experiment. I'll arrange these new features together, and we'll see whether or not it coheres into a meaningful gameplay Jeez, experience. Jeez, I wonder what will happen. <laughs> will it be coherent okay. or... Are you ready? Here it is. Not. I give you the Stanley Parable 2. Um, well, um, I mean... <gasps> My jumps! Here, right? It's sort of... Okay, never mind. Hold on. Let me do a different arrangement. Okay, yes. Yes, this is I like the uh, tense, I like, almost about. inspirational music. Version 2. <sighs> Who am I kidding? I like the carpets. This isn't Need a to go through each value one by one, one with the D-pad and anything else resets it? Oh, no! Gags, but they don't add up to anything. I was wondering about that. I was thinking I, I would do that. more than anything to create a sequel that would capture all the magic of the first game. I wanted fans to love it. No matter how good these gags are, they won't stand on their own. Correct. They would need the structure Five minutes left the on stream, gamers. The original. Wait, maybe that's it. I can take the original Stanley Parable and simply... Well, insert a few of my new features into it. Hmm. Peacefully, of course. With respect. Buddy. With care for the vision and integrity of the original Let's game. see if he keeps the uh, vision and integrity. It could, but it would need a really, really tremendous title screen. A title screen that says with bold and uncompromising conviction, this is the Stanley Parable 2. Let me see if I can whip something up. <laughs> All right, perfect. Go ahead. Take a look. Huh? Oh, yeah, I think I've heard of this horror game before. Okay, I gotta... I'll, I'll mess with that next time, I swear. This is the story of a man named... Let's see what the game's like. Stanley worked for a company in a big building okay, they've got where the balloons. he was employee number 427. But it's pretty orange. Employee number 427's job was simple. He sat at his desk in room 427 and he pushed buttons on a keyboard. Orders came to him through a monitor on his desk, telling him what buttons to push, how long to push them, and in what order. This is what employee 427 did every day of every month of every year. And although others might have considered it soul-lifting, Stanley relished every moment that the orders came in. As though he had I been think I am going to click to skip. Okay, let's uh, do this. 
Where's the red? All of his co-workers were gone. <laughs> what could it mean? Oh god. Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. No matter how hard Stanley looked, he couldn't find a trace of his co-workers. Oh, it's the bucket! Let me see if I can oh, why can't I? Aw. Oh. Where's the computer where I can put input? No input this time, I guess. Stanley picked up the bucket. Thank you. Stanley clutched the bucket tightly to his chest. And I did the door on his left. Okay. Let's see how this new game turns out. But also, I will say, if this is supposed to be Stanley, Stanley Parable 2... Stanley needed the bucket's warmth and comfort it now more than ever. It feels pretty Perhaps much... his boss's office was where he'd find answers. No. No, I... No, I can't. I can't. I'm doing so much right now. Oh, is that the sexy Come red basement? Oh, it Stanley is the sexy the red basement. upstairs to the boss's office. Oh, it's the red office. Nah. Well. Ah. Uh, we gotta do the sexy red basement. Ah! You found one of them. One of the miniature Stanley figurines. <laughs> Remember, no reward for collecting all of to these. To the dungeon. Only the intrinsic pleasure of a job well done. I was not expecting you can't it. Buy that sort of happiness, Stanley. God knows I've tried. Poggies! So, I implore you to two out of six. And every moment you come across one of these beautiful figurines. Thank you, but you're basically telling me to ignore the story at this point, you know? But Stanley just couldn't do it. He considered the possibility of facing his boss, admitting he had left his post during work hours. He might be fired for that. And in such a competitive economy, why had he taken that risk? Coffee. All because he believed everyone had vanished. His boss would think he was crazy. Coffee and nut. Then, something occurred to Stanley. Maybe, he thought to himself, maybe I am crazy. What? He looked down at the bucket in his arms. Am I crazy? Oh, the no. Bucket. The bucket returned his gaze, but said nothing at all. That's strange, Stanley thought. Usually the bucket is a source of guidance and wisdom for me in difficult times. Coffee such nut! As I want that cup so badly, close, dude. Yet felt none of its familiar reassurance and comfort. I don't know if it's creamer, but Stanley I just realized, uh, you know this isn't my bucket. It's just <gasps> a normal, everyday bucket. Someone else's bucket, perhaps. How did I end up with someone else's bucket? This is all terribly wrong. Surely no good would come what? from this. Who knows what sorts of bizarre hallucinations bucket? Stanley might experience my, not without my the bucket. psychologically grounding presence of his bucket. And indeed, now he noticed that the rooms were repeating, which was, of course, very oh. odd. And now he felt himself floating off the ground. Oh, oh shit. Gracious. Oh god. Oh hell. Without my bucket, I've gone truly mad. I'm... Where is it? I must find it. Uh -huh. Far off in the distance now, he heard it calling to him. Stanley! Stanley, it's me! The bucket! Could it truly be? He rushed forward from room to room, passing by one bucket after the next. I'm glad None the narrator is having fun. None of them were his special bucket. Come to me, Stanley. Oh, just find fucking me. two buckets inside of each he other. He had to find the bucket. Whoops. He had to return to his old friend. I, I was want to believe to that was on purpose. His sanity. I want suddenly, to believe that's on purpose. He was dead in his tracks. He knew where the voice of the bucket had been coming from. The real bucket was inside <gasps> of him all along. Aww. It was incredibly painful. Aww. Stanley doubled over in agony and blacked out. Okay. This is the story of a woman named Mariella. Okay. Is that Mariella woke up on a my wifey? Like any other. Oh no! She rose, got dressed, picked up her bucket of comfort and but, security. But we got in the stream. What? But on this particular day, her walk was interrupted by the body of a man who had stumbled through town. I can't eat the bucket though. And screaming to himself and then collapsed Too dead much on the iron. Sidewalk. Right away, she knew what the problem was. This man had no bucket. Of course he'd gone mad. 
ranting and raving about a narrator describing True all ending. of his actions and how everything is predetermined and free will is an illusion and it's all just a video game. It could all have been prevented if only he'd taken his bucket with him. Perhaps he didn't even realize he'd forgotten his bucket at home in the first place. How cruel the world can be, Marietta thought. And she hugged her own bucket even tighter. Oh. But of course, she had no time for this. There were a myriad of confusing problems she would soon have to confront at work, for which her bucket Get yourself a bu bucket. Total clarity on everything. Get and yourself a bucket, a comfort bucket. My life kicks ass. And she My life kicks ass. Yeah, go, Mariella. Okay. Oh. Okay. Uh, gamers, we gotta, we gotta end the stream. It's a marketing tactic for big bucket. Oof. Bucket plush win, gamers. I do gotta end. It was, I really am enjoying this game and I want to play it more because I like going through and like finding the new stuff, which is very fun. Hopefully I can play this another time. Maybe not next Wednesday. Maybe next Friday. We'll see. Uh, next week and next Saturday, we will be playing Neko Para 4, which is going to be suffering, but it would be a blast to have you all suffer with me at the cringe-ass Nene game. I hope you guys have a good bucket, too. Thank you guys for showing up. I hope you guys have a good rest of your weekend. Happy Friday. Happy weekend. We'll see you uh, on the next stream. If you guys want updates on when I'm streaming, feel free to check out the Discord. All right. Have a good night, bucket, bucket, bye, bye, buckets, bucket, bye.